It's uh, 30 blessings, right? Yeah, 30. Why, hello there. Uh, 30 blessings upon you. <laughs> Welcome to Board Games with Beta Bros. I realize I don't have any lights on right now. Let me just real quickly fix that. How's everyone doing? Welcome back. Uh, we're playing more Pathfinder Adventure card game. But uh, before we get started, let's have a look and talk about the men of myth and legend that are joining me today. Uh, Zippy, what myth and legend do you have surrounding your booty? Um, I'm here mm. and uh, I'm, I'm pretty good. Just uh, <laughs> very chill. It's a very chill day. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell. And what about your myth, Mr. Doc Gast? How many of those do you have? Uh, I, I'm not sure our relationship is at the point where we can discuss my myth uh, so freely. So, yeah, we're back. We're playing more of this uh, hot, sticky mess. The gooiness is insane. Um, we're on 2-4. Act 2-4. Uh, the scenario is the cult exposed. Uh, during this scenario, if you acquire a spell, bury a card, and the reward is a random spell from the box. So, who's ready to fuck this piglet? Um, sure, yeah, no, fuck a piglet. Yeah, fuck a piglet. So, Man, fuck a piglet. The waterfront is the only place with actual monsters in it. So I might go there. <clears throat> what do you guys think? Like, no, yeah, there's like, there's like a lot of monsters there, though. I need five cards. Okay. Let it hit up the academy. Remember, every time you acquire a spell, you have to bury a card. Although I suppose you can just acquire a spell and then immediately bury it and just have them in for your next game. Yeah. This is true. So it's not like you're losing any health. You're just not gaining any. All right, cool. Yeah, all right. I got my elven breastplate. I'm good. Uh, so yeah, I think I'll um, I think I'll hit up the monster deck because I like doing it when we're full health. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna do that. I don't know. I, th I figured you'd be better off doing it once you've kind of, you know, chewed through your deck a little bit and tuned it down, so you've got nothing but blessings. It's like, right now, let's go deal with all those monsters. That's not a bad idea. Hmm. Well, where's the next place I can go? Maybe the gate? I mean, they're all... They're all... Not terrible. So, Gosh. Intelligence Arcane 6 check at the Academy. <clears throat> City Gate and Waterfront is Bandit Henchman. Acrobatics 8 check is the Mill. So that one's going to be the hardest to close. And Temple. Now, if you temporarily close that... Do you just temporarily close it when you when you're there? You don't have to make the check or nothing. Yeah, it's you may close this location automatically. So there's there's no you just ask them and they'll close it. Okay, so I think, nice at the temple. I think all lazy. Uh, I'm not sure. Add two to your checks with a slashing trait. Oh, that's not bad. When playing with a weapon, subtract from one each one die each roll. Oh yeah, no, I'm not, not going to start there. Actually, that sounds rough. Uh, if you fail a combat check, shuffle a random monster from the box into the location deck. Okay, I'll, I'll go to the city gate. I'll start there. Uh, you get so seven, right? Don't you zip it? start at temple. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Um, awesome. You have no idea what this is other than the familiar Pathfinder title. It's basically, um just a deck building game with pathfinder trimmings mostly um, they do have a game on steam that's called pathfinder adventures yeah. and i think th i think that's supposed to be the fully scripted and whatnot version of this game yeah it's like a it's like an actual proper game like i think you yeah. have to i think it's free to play and then you have to buy parts whatever so yeah we're pretty deep into this one though so uh where are you going zippy where are you starting uh, the, the academy. The academy. Of course, he's going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to churn through this entire deck in like two turns. He's not going to lose any health from it because he can just. Well, you said that last time we did play. this game, uh, Zippy failed <laughs> to do that pretty spectacularly. All right, I'm going to roll. I got a three. All right, Doc, you can go. 
five. And a five. And a six. All right, Zippy, you're up first. And a six arena. Fucking okay, so majors, goddamn. <laughs> the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to detect magic. Nice. Uh, noise. And hold. Nice. To what, did, what did we get roll last a time? Arcane. What was the the result thing that we got last time? It was a power, right? Yeah, I can't remember what I chose. Oh yeah, no, I... I, that's right. I got extra strength card. I got an extra plus one on my strength. That's right. It was skills. I got an extra plus oh, one. Oh, that's right. Yes, because I didn't get our intel. very first one, so I only have the one ticked off. That's oh no no, I got a plus one onto my uh, recharge, so on your recharge. I have to roll a. Arcane four, so. Well, there you okay, go. so D plus <laughs> one plus one. Okay, no, nope, there's no. Four. Oh wait, hold on. Uh, so plus one from the intel. Yeah, you can't. You, you actually can't plus... fail that. That's right. You got the plus one in your int, and now you can't fail the fucking recharge on this, because it's one and then a two, and then a one. Yeah. Like... You're rolling at a plus three, so you always get a four at the very minimum. Yeah, okay. So let's <laughs> I remember reveal that. the top one. Is I it remember. magic? It isn't, so it goes back to the top. I don't um, immediately mm -hmm. uh, encounter it. I take the deck, and I go bloop, and then I reveal the top card. If the spell, I can draw it. Okay. <laughs> Um, now we're going to actually do the explore. I remember now. <laughs> I remember how stupid your deck is. Uh, the, the Troubadour. Recharge this card at, to add a 1d6 to your non-combat dexterity. I don't even think you can make that. Deck. I don't even think you can make that check. What's your deck six? No, but you can't my make charisma... That. Hold on. What's is my charisma? Six? Yeah, you can make the six one on the yeah. charisma, so... Just roll the d6. Yeah. Roll that's, a d6 and hope I hit a six. That's in the middle there. Okay. Okay. Doesn't happen. So he goes off into the hireling deck, which is which one? Uh oh, we'll flip him. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, all right. Ragtag. Um, all that means is that I was in your bed the entire time, my man. Well, I forgot to flip over a blessing. Uh, I'm going to discard the toad to explore again. My man. Later, toad. I'm just going to make a couple um, of these because I feel like everyone's going to need them. Potion right. of healing. Okay. So it's an intel check. Uh, that's, a, that's, that's a 13. That's a hit. Yeah. So is it spells? If every time I acquire a spell, I bury? Yeah, it's uh, Every time you acquire yeah, a spell, specifically a spell. Okay, so this goes to my hand. I don't have to bury it. I'll uh, discard the uh, Night's well, you, Watch. You don't, have to, you don't have to bury the spell that you acquired. You just have to bury something. So having yeah. trash in your hand isn't bad in case you find a spell and like, I want to keep this. So I'm going to bury healing my healing is potion. always good for a man that literally... Goes through his entire deck. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So let's explore again. Oh, Toxic damn. cloud. You oh, you really okay. want that? So let's see. So you can roll anything above. Do you want a blessing? Because we tried to get this last time and it fucked up. So do you want a blessing to make sure you get this? Yeah. Just. Yeah. Sure. I remember. I, I remember last time actually. You uh, you just kept rolling without waiting first. So. Yeah. yeah. So um, I'm, I'll, I'll give you a blessing me... on this because I've got them out. So I may as well use them. Display so this card get... when a character encounters a bane. Any character who encounters a monster this turn adds one d six with the poison trait to their combat check. Discard this card at the end of um, the turn if you do. Okay, so actually, banishes. Zippy, if you read the the uh, location, it says on your first encounter, on a turn, if you encounter anything other than a spell, you may after the exploration you may explore again. So technically, okay. you still have a toad in your hand, but okay, so we'll 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 retcon with the toad. Okay, that'll work. Yeah. Um, so yeah, no, if I could, I could do a blessing. Yep. It's done. So you roll two intelligence checks now. So you okay. roll two. So here's the first one is a 10. Yeah, you got it. So I get it. Yep. You get it. I'm cool. going to bury it. 
Uh, uh, I'm not so sure you want to bury that one right now. What uh, does Spyglass do? Spyglass lets you look through a deck. Okay, Examine we're going to keep this one. We're going to, to, we're going to bury Acid Arrow to add Toxic Cloud to the hand. What does this one actually do? Display the only reason I'm saying that is because the waterfront has a lot of monsters in it, and you can chain them. Like as long as once oh, you cast okay. Toxic Cloud, it works on every fight that turn. Any character okay. who encounters a monster this turn adds one d six with the poison trait to her combat check. Discard the card at the end of this turn. Um, Girthy. Okay. okay. So since I acquired a spell, I can search again. Yeah. Um, wisdom. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's a D eight for me. Uh, it's still magic though. Yeah, no, yeah, it that's is still fine. technically a spell. Uh, I have one blessing, but I'd like to hold that just in case. That's fine. And we don't need um, any cures, really, ultimately. Yeah, and I, 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 I have I have a toad just in case. What? Hold on. Oh, I hit F. I was like, what? Okay, so that's not a hit. So what did you need? Away. Six. Don't you have? Don't you have six. plus two wisdom? No, you don't. No. I have plus two wisdom. That's right. Yes. We discard the toad. And we'll get rid of the uh, the cure. Um, hold on. Yeah, I really wish this this game had screen scrolling. Okay. Uh, you don't use Wazda for again. scrolling. Uh, oh shit! It's hard for me to. Each character at an open I location guess. summons and encounters a zombie henchman. If any character does not defeat the zombie henchman, the zombie horde is undefeated. All right. So zombie henchman right here. Uh oh. Yep. Zombie minion. So we don't need to make a copy of it. We can just all see it here. So, um, okay. I guess you go. So first. it happens to each of you. Yeah, you can go first, Sippy. Okay. Um, let's. I'm going to hit him with a lightning, uh, lightning touch. Yep. Lightning uh, bolt. So lightning that's one d twelve plus two d four. Two d four. Okay, you need another. Yes. D4? Okay, one sec. Okay, so that's 13. Yeah, that's easy. You got it. Before modifiers. Yep. So, uh, and then I see if I uh, recharge it. So, do yeah, I even have to roll that? You're good. No, you do. You needed a six. Yeah. So. yeah. So, three, six, boom. Anything over a two. And you're good. Uh, hey, what up, AP? How you doing? Um, all right. You want to go next, Doc, and defeat this minion? Uh, sure. Min one. So, I roll a. D6 what are you using? and a D... Oh, that's right. You took the fucking glaive. Yeah. Yeah, I have a, I have an actual weapon now. You have two weapons. Uh, where's the D10? Uh, there's a green one. So it should be here. Oh, there it is. Yep, cool. Uh, so it's a D6 and a D10 plus two. Yep. Nine plus uh, two? Yeah, you good. Yep, cool. He did. Alright, so I need... Uh, I don't have a weapon right now, so I'm going to use Inflict. Um, for your combat check, you may discard this card to roll your Divine Die plus 1d6 with a magic trait. Um, so my Divine Die is a d8 plus a d6 um, with the magic, and I'm going to uh, flip a card. Okay, that sucks. But I get another D6 on top of that, so. Uh, okay, 12. Yeah, yep. we're good. Lucky. Lucky I had that extra 6. <laughs> Alright, so you're good. Um, so we that... have defeated the zombie horde at the academy. Mm -hmm. Now they will reward the wizard with more spells. Uh, the... Let's see. Nope. Okay, so that ends my turn, so. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Unless you want to use a spyglass. No, I'm going to use that probably later. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, Doc, I guess you're up, my man. Oh, wait. Hang on. Uh, uh, succeeded. Yep, divine okay. 6 checked. Recharge this card. Okay. What's that? Divine 8. Uh, okay. So, pew. 4, 5, 6. We're good. So, that recharges. Then. All right. Okay. We'll do my blessing. It's a blessing of Goramut. Go ram me. Go ram you. 
By the way, uh, do yeah, you guys cool. like my new uh, wait, what do I do? red background thingy? It's all animated. You can't really tell there, but it is animated, so trust me. Uh, when I moved, when you move or are moved here, discard. Okay, I guess it's kind of a good thing I started here instead of moving here later. I don't want to discard shit for no reason. Yeah. Uh, any character at another location may invade an encounter and move here, discarding two cards instead of the normal one. Then reset her hand and end. Okay, so you can, as long as the temple's out, you can always just kind of retreat there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I mean, that's, that's interesting, I suppose. So the idea is there's more of the overlay that I haven't added in yet. I'm just oh, well, waiting hello. for the final animations to be done. So um, once that's all up and running, it's going to look uh, real smicko. 12 plus 2. Oh, you're going for a blessing? What do you mean? Really? Divine? Probably. Really? And you got a two? <laughs> uh, um, no, wait, D12 plus three, because I have plus one wisdom now. Ha ha! I actually got it. <laughs> by the about fucking hair of your chinny chin chin there, man. It was like, man, are we still doing this? Pathfinder, please. So you're going to discard it? Keep going? Uh, what's this? Non-combat. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Don't you get... um? Oh no, that's if you encounter it. You may automatically acquire it. Um, it what's wait? Someone has something in. Um, Travel Lion, thanks for the host, man. Uh, your first expiration in your turn. Oh no, you don't have that. Who has that power? I know one of us has. Are you talking about the blessing of the gods? The ones that you can just pick up. I always free? forget. It, it's something that I always forget. You know. So. Yeah. yeah. The the blessing of the gods you can pick up for free, but mm. the specified blessings you have to have the. You have to actually roll for them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Um, yep. Yeah, so I will discard this, and we will continue looking. A throwing axe. I don't think I've ever seen that. It's basic though. Uh, uh, dexterity no, it's a, or it's range. elite actually. It's a what? It's elite. Oh, it's okay. not basic. B is uh, like weapon pack B. Oh. Hmm. Uh. Are you yeah, proficient that's... with weapons? I am, but I don't have ranged, so I'd, I'd still be rolling a d4. Yeah, there's no point getting it then. Uh, yeah, I, I'm gonna. I'll roll for it, but I. <clears throat> Wait, no, you won't. You get. You can't even make it. It's a six. Yeah. yeah that's unfortunate. All right, so that goes away. Uh, I'll use my last blessing. Always. Yeah, I'll use it. Gotta get through them decks, man. Yeah, statistically, yeah. There's gonna be more blessings in here than anything else, so... Mm -hmm. uh, I will roll for that guy. It's plus three, yeah? Twelve plus three. Yeah, you're good. There we go. That's that's more like what I want to see. You gonna keep going? Discard it. Nice. Yeah. Fucking power through this one. Oh, look! Ooh, a, a short sword! sword. <laughs> A short sword? This isn't even, like, I didn't even, it's not like, hey, I have this mighty weapon for you. I just found this in the bushes. Like, hey, did someone, someone lose a sword? Uh, strength D6. I love how there's two divine spellcasters and one OP wizard going, and for my next trick. <laughs> uh, I actually fucking got it too. God damn it. I didn't, I was like, I'll just roll for it and not care. I didn't really want it because now it's just filling my hand up. Welcome to hell. So that's what you got. You can't keep going. Uh, yep, that ends my turn. Uh, I'm gonna go right ahead and discard that now. Yeah. All right, so uh, I'm going to explore for free. Wait, what's this? Okay, if you fail, combat check. All right, so it's important that I get a weapon at some point. Oh, goody. <laughs> Henchman straight away. When closing. All right, uh, hmm. let's see. If undefeated, shuffle the co top card of the Blessings deck into this location. Oh. Wait, the Blessings deck? Or is it? Is this the Blessings deck or is this the Blessings deck? Uh, this is the Blessings deck. This okay. is the box. Okay, yep. If, under, if defeated, you may... Okay, so I need 11 to beat it. I don't have any weapons. Uh, I could add a Blessing to it. Uh, let's see here. Um, 
to a combat check. So I can add, I'm going to discard the sheriff and get another D6 on that. Do I, what's in here? Do I want to keep it open? There's two weapons in here. I think we're okay closing this one. Like straight away. Uh, I mean, yeah, there's... It's going to be really hard for me to do it because I don't have a weapon. Um, there's actually not that many weapons out. Like, the temple's got no weapons left in it. I've already grabbed both of those. Yeah. The mill has one weapon. Oh, that's the thing. I, I, don't has none. I don't necessarily need any better weapons. Like, I don't know if we... I don't know if there even is better weapons in the deck than what I have. So... I'm okay just killing this thing, um, but I need to actually kill it. So, uh, what is it? Uh, melee, which is a D8 plus th th two, uh, four. So, D8 plus four. Um, discard to get a D6. So, that's another D6. And then I'm going to pop a squat. Cool. So, that gets to the bottom for another D6 because paladins are dope. Girthy. And uh, that's plus four. No, wait. No, it's not plus four. It's plus two. Because I don't have a melee weapon. So it's plus two. Um, I can throw a blessing in the bin. Wait, what's this one? Non -combat. Uh, do you want a blessing? I have two. Okay, yeah. If you want to throw a blessing at me, that'd be cool. Girthy. Uh, take the blessing of Porag. What's that one do? Uh, it's just best. one die. Yeah, I don't have any of the combat ones. Those are, seem to be like the least common. Uh, Daddy Poo Poo and Lavender Tea. Thanks for the host. Uh, all right. Um, okay, so another D eight. All right, we should be okay. Maybe twenty one. Oh yeah, we got it. All right, so now I need to defeat a uh, uh, henchman. A bandit henchman. Okay, you got it. Yeah, somewhere. There we go, bandit. Kind of looks more like an ogre, but all right. Yeah, I'm with you on that. Uh, eight. All right, so redoing all of that. Uh, before the encounter, recharge a card of your choice from your hand. Recharge a card. Um, yep. I guess it has to be the Elven Breastplate, right? Uh, not so sure about it. Uh, I mean, are you confident in your ability to not take damage in the fight? It's 8 damage. I'll be rolling... Um, at least a D8 and D6. And remember, if you don't close it on this, we'll have to empty this deck before you can close it again. And uh, I would actually have to add another monster into that deck. Yeah, so uh, maybe... Uh, I suppose if you if you need the breastplate, you haven't closed it anyway, have you? No, that's right. So that's what I'm saying. Um, and the Nightwatch is always better in my hand than in the deck. Um, so I'll recharge that. And uh, so D A uh, D six for finding out. Oh, look at that! Yahoo! You got mending. I do indeed. I need to get a spell uh, weapon though. <laughs> um, okay. Um, all right. I should probably have held on to that fucking short sword. I just give it to you and then mend it into an icy spear. <laughs> yeah, maybe. All right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna use my blessing of Torag. Why not? Oh, we're good. Look at that. Fucking maximum roll right there. Cool. Fuck off. Um, and that closes. So what did we miss out on? Uh, oh. Cloak of Elvenkind. Reveal this card to add 1d6 to stealth check. Recharge the card to succeed at your stealth check. That's not bad. Longbow. What's the other weapon? And a mace. Oh, yeah. Fuck it, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much a sweet fuck all. Yeah. Other than that cloak, it's it's all pretty bad. The only reason for the cloak is because it's stealth, which is something none of us have. Yeah. Yeah, but I can't take items anyway, so. All right. So. What is... That's my... That's my turn. Uh, what happens when I close this? No effect. No effect. 
Well, that's that done. Uh, Zippy, I flipped a thingy for you, my man. You're up. He's probably not there. That's okay. I'll take you. To uh, my name's no. Zippy the Wizard, and I'm going to do. It. I'm going to wow you with a magic trick. Watch this <laughs> deck he's disappear. Already, already done I've already done one he's, for he's, you. Right oh, now. okay. Yep, yep. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is uh, detect magic. It recharges. <laughs> it recharges. <laughs> oh, Lord. It automatically recharges. I'm just waiting for us to enter an encounter where everything's immune to magic. As if he's just going to be like, well, uh... Hey, all right. Pardon? Eric, you'll want to skeleton. Let's see. Um, he's all right. metal and poison, mental and poison traits. Okay, well, he's wow. Let's that see. that you need. Whoa, that S, that hard S. Who, how many max players can you have in this game? Uh, I think it's like six, I think is the max, right? Yeah, six people. Let's see, six we'll just people. do. 1d12 and a 2d4 with uh, acid arrows. Yeah. So, yeah, so basically, um, Gonzo. the whole point of this game is that right. you get characters and they can die permanently and shit like that, but. And acid arrow recharges. For every tick you see on here, it's us upgrading our characters. Um, so there's nothing but good stuff left in this deck for you now. And uh, you've got rid of the barrier and the monster. In so the now cards it's just like here, four spells. You can Enjoy. sort of. Upgrade what type of uh, cards you have in your hand. Yeah, two stuff. spy glasses. I shall. It's really, really good. I like this game a lot. It's one of my favorite games. Fiery weapon. Fiery weapon. All right. Um, Wait, is well, this the one see. that you used to have, Doc? Uh, yes. Yeah. All right, we're gonna roll. Turns out we uh, we didn't need it because our front line Got has it. the will of God behind her. <laughs> You gonna keep that one, or you... yeah, you might as well discard that one straight away. I acquired a, uh, a spell, so I get to explore again. I'm gonna do you a favor here, Zip. I'm just gonna move all these bags up here, my man, so you can have a bit more space. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, that's a D8. I have to make a wait. Wisdom. Yeah. To make a six on a D eight. Does this, anyone need five fine traps? Uh so what what's this magic spell? Discard this card to add two dice to any check to defeat a barrier. Oh, I don't think I mean really it's, it feels that. super situational, but if yeah, I had no, more spells lots, I'd definitely take it. Alright. I acquire it. And then I explore again. Uh, GM, I would like to auto cast exploration, please. <laughs> uh, Skinshaw, uh, cultist. Um, no, I have. Some more I have oh no! That's no... oh, cool. I can do dog slicer. Let's see. For your combat check, reveal this card to roll your strength or melee die plus 1d6 so that's going to be a 1d6 plus 1 plus a 1d6 uh, take, a, take a blessing on top of that so add another d6 to that okay and if um, any of you get a what uh you may add an additional 1d6 um, if i discard it if you discard it and if you roll a one yeah. it breaks right so you might as well discard it yeah yeah i'm gonna discard it so you get another one yeah okay what do you need an eight <laughs> got yeah, I think you got yeah, an eight. Um, and you didn't. It didn't. You didn't need to throw it away as well. Uh, so you needed intelligence, arcane six check to beat it. Do you want to close it though? Yeah. Yeah, there's, I'll close there's, it. There's, well, there's only like three cards left in there, and they're all spells. No, they're not all spells. He's already gotten a bunch of spells. No, oh, there's, there's one left. Though, yeah. And it's a spell. One. Yeah. No, I'll just close it. So I succeeded the intel. All right. Okay. On closing, you may shuffle a spell from your discard pile into your deck. You missed out on frost rate. See what happens. See what happens. I don't think I have a. Let's see. 
Do I have a spell on my discard? Well, they have six. All right. Oh, well. No, because you just fucking automatically recharge everything. <laughs> All right. The blessing and the curse. Wait, what do you what do you get out of there? It just gives you. Yeah, he, he can. Oh, he can from recharge your shuffle. It. I get you. Yeah. Cool. <clears throat> oh man, we're flogging this one today. All right. Um. All right, Doc. You're up, my man. That was a long Yo, turn, but up. you did it all. You did it all. Alrighty. Uh, man, I'd, I'd like to come over and mend you to... No, I already oh, got... What's better, your hammer or the spear? They're the same, except one's okay. cold. And there are some monsters that react to cold, you know? Um, but bludgeoning is also still good, so... And you got your magic half plate. So yeah, I'm good, man. I don't really need anything. I just need to sort of filter <clears> my deck a little more and get rid of some of these cards in my thing. So, you know, I'm good. Uh, yeah, I'll just I'll just explore. That's yes, my boy. It's a cure. I mean, I'll more divine that. spells this round gives you more feet, uh, you know, stuff. So. Yep. Uh, D12 plus three. Boop. Got it. You can't explore any more, though. <laughs> so... No, but I'm going to use this cure on myself right away. Oh, dude, you have eight cards in your discard already? Fucking hell. I mean, you haven't uh, picked up... Mo like... They're mostly all blessings. You've been... Yeah, because you've been picking up blessings, <clears throat> right? So, yeah. Yep. Uh, that's what I roll. 1d4 plus 1. So I cure for 5. I thought you got Fuck plus yeah. 2. I know uh, that's only on my divine heal. Oh right, okay. Yep. Yeah. So I take five of these. Wait. What are you? How are you curing then? With the the actual cure spell that I just picked up. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm having a day, man. <laughs> All right. Make sure you refresh. You shuffle that deck too, my man. Yep. All right. So that's your turn. Cool, cool. Uh, I don't. Do I need this mending now? Because you've got your weapon and your your. No, you don't need out, it. Right? But as yeah, it's up to you whether you want to discard it or not. So. Uh, I'd rather discard it and have a shot at another blessing in my hand. Go for it then. Is that holy light? <clears throat> or are you good? Yeah, I'm holding onto that because it's fucking holy light. It's the holy light. Oh, I saw a Ready Player One as well, on the, on the weekend. Oh yeah, fiery weapon, holy light, glaive do this give me a give me a demon give me a demon i wish to purge it drive me closer i wish to hit it with my sword uh so where do you think i should go mill um because i can't that's gonna be real hard for me to close you because so you're down to six on your deck so you're you're probably mostly blessings in there by now right let me take a look uh so i've got one blessing in my discard i got one in my hand and i have seven total so that means there's like five in there so they're mostly they're mostly blessings. So I might as well go to the other place because this one's gonna be real hard for me to close. I, I, I like I yeah. literally won't be able to close it because it's just yeah. it's a dexterity acrobatics. The only one who can come close is uh, as it turns out, Zippy the wizard. <laughs> well, I mean, if we have to, we can just leave it till last and have the the villain end up there. All right. So when playing a weapon, subtract one from each die rolled after an exploration. You may discard two cards to explore again. So. You know, I got fate on my side. Um, summon and defeat a bandit henchman to close. Okay. See, if I had the icy spear right now... Um, You'd add an extra die. I'd yeah. add an extra die, but I don't. So, you know, that's just how it goes, though. So, not a big Of course, it, it, you know, there's always the, the other... After other the encounter, goes, yeah. the hellhound does one fire damage to each character at this location. Okay. Uh, okay, so... I'm using Would my Would you like hand. fiery weapon? Hold up real quick. Uh, so D8, which gives me plus four. It's a plus four right now. Add my weapon, which adds another plus... And another D8, which makes it a plus five as well. So I'm rolling two D8 plus five to beat a ten. Uh, so I only need a five. <laughs> I don't think I need to filter my deck. Uh, remember, you do subtract one from each die rolled. Okay, so I, yeah, all right. I'll uh, 
I'll do a thing then. Cool. We're good. Add a d6 to that. d6 plus 1. So I'm rolling plus 6 right now. And you need to hit an 9, 8. Uh, I got 16. So, so that's uh, 16 minus 3. So I got 13. Yep. You're good. Goodbye. That was actually a little close, but that negative one on every die roll kind of hurts you because you just keep adding die to your attacks. I know, I know, but it's fine. That's I'm probably the best person to do it. It would hurt someone who had a D4 on their rolls a lot more than it hurts me with a D6. So. I don't know. I think it would be a, a place for a spellcaster to hang out, but that's just me. Uh, all right. I am going to get rid of my night watch and keep exploring. Bergalilo. Um, charisma diplomacy. Uh, what's my charisma? 10. D10. Yeah. All right. Where's that green die? Uh, okay. Plus D6. Nine. Yeah, we're good. All right. I'm going to... Uh, okay, well, I don't get to keep searching with him, but I didn't have to discard my weapon, so all the yeah, <laughs> well as ends well. Um, okay. And you do still have two blessings. So. Uh, what's the current blessing? Blessing of the gods. All right, I might as well get rid of the blessing of the gods then. Let's keep going. Ambush. Uh, the difficulty of this barrier is increased by the adventure deck number of the current scenario if any so what we're at four so it's plus four uh if defeated you may immediately explore again if undefeated exactly okay um so four so that makes it 13. uh you can actually use your burglar on this to add 1d10 to stealth barrier. or disable oh. or your check to defeat a barrier Th that is a barrier all right um yep yeah what has this work when playing a weapon. Okay. Uh, okay, when playing a weapon. Uh, so, I could add wisdom perception. What's my wisdom? My wisdom is a d8. So, wisdom... Or dex acrobatics. So, to be wisdom, so you well, get a d8. a d10. Okay, recharge this card. Okay, so that recharges. So D10. Um, and we'll add D6 to it as well. Cool. All right. To beat a what? 13? Yep. Wow. I, uh, if undefeated, examine this location, deck two, find a monster, encounter it, subtracting one from each die, roll from each check, banish this card, and shuffle the remaining cards into the location deck. Uh, okay, so I just get to fight a monster. <laughs> cool. <laughs> uh, okay, so examine this location deck. Okay. Well, that's actually pretty bad, because that's subtracting two from each die rolled. All right. Um, uh, te technically not a monster. It's a henchman. Okay, well, that sucks. There you go. So you'll have to fight him, and then once the fight's over, you shuffle the deck. So, so I'm revolving neg I'm removing two from each die roll. Okay. Yep. That's uh, how about that fiery weapon? <laughs> um, what's it take to beat this guy? Uh, if undefeated, deals one combat damage to each other character at this location. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, I'll take it. Actually. Do you want fiery weapon or aid? Fiery weapon gives 1d4, aid gives 1d6, but aid can work on anything, which might come in handy when closing Yeah, give me, give me a fiery weapon, man. Yeah. All right. Have a, have a 1d4. 1d4? Which, I mean... It, okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, that's, yeah, not a great spell. I mean, it, it adds it adds a, a d2. Uh, this okay. This is going to be pretty so... hard to beat, so... This is... Plus... Six now, but I'm rolling negative two, four, six, eight. So it's a negative two, basically, from the top of the roll. 
Um, that's right, yeah. D8, D8, and then a D4 and a D6. Yep, okay. 16, so minus 2. Yeah, we're good. Minus 4. No. Oh, minus wait, two. Minus, minus 2 from each die rolled. Yeah. Two, four, so that's six, 2, 4, eight. 6, 8. I'm at a plus 6. Okay, sorry. Yep. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's fine. 14. Hit the mark. Boom. Just fuck. Yeah, you were making fun of my fiery weapon. Now, you, now you're like, hmm. It gave me a, it gave me one, which was enough, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so you know, not so bad, I guess. Um, all right. So what did it say to do? Uh, banish this card and shuffle the remaining cards into the location deck. Okay. All right. Well, at least now we know who's there. True that. True that. Uh, so I'm going to keep going then. Uh, I will use my Blessing of Torg. Hey, all right. Uh, the difficulty to defeat the barriers increased by the current adventure deck number, so four. So 14 melee. If defeated, add 1d4 random weapons from the box to your hand. Nice. <laughs> That'd be really good. Uh, okay. Uh, there's actually some pretty decent stuff in here still. Yeah. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, uh, uh, yeah, do strength. Oh man. I thought the, the dog sword was called. There's a horse chopper. <laughs> well, I mean, horses are technically bigger than dogs. So for you, for your combat check, reveal this card to roll your strength or melee die plus one D 10 plus one. If you fail, you can reroll. Is it magic? Uh, melee slashing two-handed magic. Yeah, that's actually a pretty fucking good weapon. Yeah. All right. So um, I'm rolling plus six here with no uh, negatives. Do you wanna... No, I'm rolling plus six with no negatives. It's only a fourteen to beat. So. Do you hang on? Do, do, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm good. I got an eighteen plus six. So, all right. Now, um, can I? Can I? Can I? Uh, get a blessings of the gods on my D four. <laughs> uh, it's on a check, and this isn't technically a check. This is a a account roll. Okay, fine. Other, other, otherwise, I'd use hey! eight. But that's, that adds one D six. I got four. All right, what do we get? Sling, horse jump, hey! <laughs> <laughs> returning throwing axe. Okay, all right. Cool. <laughs> What's the returning throwing answer? For your combat check, reveal this card to roll your dexterity or range die plus one d eight. You may additionally recharge this card to add another recharge to add a one d six. Damn, that is actually good. And the horse chopper. For your combat check, you may reveal this card to roll your strength or melee die one d ten plus one. That's really good, actually. If you are proficient with weapons, the difficulty of this check is increased by four. If you fail a combat check using this weapon, you may discard this card and ignore the result and re-roll the dice. What's this say? Trip the horse, watch him drop. As he whinnies, chop, chop, chop. Don't stop there, because the horse is big. When it croaks, dance the goblin jig. <laughs> okay, perfect, man. I love it. So I have to go down to five, right? And then uh, yes. So I'm going to keep... Uh, I'll keep the returning. I'll put that in the bin. I'll put that that's in not the... just a returning throwing axe. That's a returning throwing axe plus one. So it's magic. Yeah, I know. We're... Guys, we got some good weapons for the end of the round here. All right. I lose no health. And that's it for me, I guess. You actually healed three hit points, technically, doing that. <laughs> that four. Four hit the, points, man. Yeah. I healed four hit points. <laughs> I'm growing stronger. The weapons. They cannot harm me no longer. All right. Uh, Zippy, my man, you're up the duda. Sweet. I'm just going to visit Welcome. the little girl's room. I'll be right back. I'm going to come and 
Say howdy, how to you. Uh, that's that's already done. Blessings done. Oh, blessings done. Okay. Yep. I'm going to uh, discard a spyglass. Okay. Uh, examine the top two cards of your location deck and put them back in any order. Okay. Well, uh, Caltrops acquires a four. You could probably grab that. Oh no, you've only got a six. Yeah. Just uh tempt to close. So um I think the thing that I would want to do is uh probably yeah. toxic cloud. Uh oh, I don't have anything that makes me draw anything. Wait, no, I do. Yeah, I'm going to cast Toxic Cloud. Um, and it adds 1d6 to poison trait. Oh, is he immune to poison? Uh, no, he's human. Okay, okay, sweet. So I, I attempt to cast. I reveal the top card. It's lightning touch, so I draw it. Now let me see if I can uh, get Toxic Cloud back into the deck. Um, it's a one. It's uh, a, you need a yeah. ten. So you need to hit like what a four. Yeah. Okay. So it doesn't go. It doesn't come back. That's fine. the 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 fact of the matter is, I was able to get a uh, lightning touch. That's what I wanted. Yo, what up, friends? So, need... so, so you've got lightning touch, and you also get a one d six with poison on it. Yep. As if he's coming over to show you how real wizards do it. Oh, is he just? Yeah, he just like he just entered your thing and and encountered the dude straight. Like he's like, yeah, I'm just hang on, I'll just I'll just find the the henchman, kill him for you. Nice. Hey, how do you guys feel about adding a fourth in the next round? Because I have someone that would who, work. who wants to play. I can uh, I can only do a couple, like maybe one or two more rounds after this anyways, because I have uh, people coming over to do some work on the house. And i got to oversee them. So um, Let's see. That's a 23. I don't know if it kills it. Does that kill that? Uh, let's see. So he's an 11, and 23 minus 11... It's obviously um, one, so no, it doesn't. Fuck. All right, no, it kills it. Okay, so what's the attempt to close on this thing? Uh, henchman. Uh, summon and defeat a bandit henchman. Yep. I will summon Jeez, and defeat that bandit henchman. Hold on, let me roll to see if I get uh, lightning touchback, and then I have to see if I pull anything. I get lightning touchback. Ooh. Oh, I should have discarded the Acolyte. I could have gotten uh, 1d6 or 1d4 on my uh, recharge. No. Recharge this card. Yeah, no, I could have added a 1d6. Oh, well, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. I mean, you haven't really had to use her for that all that much. Exactly. <laughs> it's like, yeah. okay, maybe sweet. maybe it's time to get a new fucking ally because you you missed a king recharge these days. Well, I didn't. You know, Toxic Cloud is actually a pretty powerful spell. So. Yep, because oh, you've got a lightning touch again, and now you have one d six on that again because you cast light, uh, toxic cloud this turn. So, all right, I'm just gonna roll it. Oh, god dang it! Gosh, dang god it! Dang it, Bobby! Dang it, Bobby! Damn it, Bobby! Uh, uh, that's a ten. That's like. a ten. Yep. You can just. What do I get? Answer. What uh, do I have to? Eight. Uh, eight. eight. Okay. Uh, so before the encounter, recharge a card of your choice from your hand. So you would add oh, uh, let's definitely recharge the Acolyte, because my my big Mamma Jamma spell is already in the graveyard, so it doesn't, doesn't matter for me to use it. Uh, he won't be okay. ready for 20 minutes, so we could probably play another game before he even gets there. So. so he is defeated. You have closed the waterfront. On closing, all characters at this location discard a card. Lovely! Oh <laughs> I guess Thanks. I'll... Um, guys, should I get rid of my 
horse chopper plus one, my magic half plate, my warhammer plus one, my uh, returning throwing axe plus one, or my sling. Okay. Um, I think we'll get rid I, of my sling. I'm uh, discarding. No, man, that horse chopper. Yeah. I don't think we've gone up against any horse. Shooter on medallion. Um, Doesn't that give you like fucking reduced damage to you by a million? Right now is banish the potion of healing. Okay. Why are you banishing? To, oh, to use it. To yeah, heal. to use it. Okay, shuffle one d four random cards. Nah, so from... it banished, it actually goes back. Oh, okay. The item. Yeah, yeah. Until the last scenario, in which time, at which time we actually start throwing them away. This is that kind of game. Uh, yeah. So, would Jenna, you guys want the throwing axe? What is your? Uh, I think maybe I Zippy. Mean, Zippy. Zippy, Zippy would actually, because he can take one weapon, right? Um, I don't think. He... Yes, you can. I don't um, know what yes, you can. That might be. That might be a good weapon for him then, because he has the dex. Like, well, he's got the most decks of us. He could actually use it. And it gives you a D8 as well. So that's not so bad. Because I'm going to throw that away for sure. Uh, actually, if you aren't proficient with weapons, it's plus four. Oh, I don't think he's proficient with weapons. No, he doesn't have any I don't think he even can be proficient. No. Yeah. Yep. All right, so that's your turn then, Zip Zip. I'll be right back. Go let the dog out. Cool. All right. Zop, zopi, zobu. All right, I'll do a zop, zobu, thing zobu. for you. Uh, wait, what, what was here, by the way? Bugbear. Yeah. Garbage. Okay. Okay. Is that a weapon or an item? That's an item. Cool. Uh, I'll do my blessing. I already did it. I already did it. Oh. Alright, um, getting kind of nervous now because I haven't encountered the henchman and the villain's got to be in one of these two. Yeah, it's probably going to be in the mill if our luck is good. Which, yeah. Alright, uh, I wouldn't mind healing myself. You got six and ten, dude. You're fine. What do you got in there? Yeah, uh, but there's a bunch of you blessings. You got two blessings in there and a, and a cure, so. Yep. Uh, uh, yeah, actually, I guess I've pulled most of my blessings back out already. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, that's right, because I healed myself last turn. Yeah, mm -hmm. cool. All right, uh, yeah. I will explore. Turns out the little girl's room has wine. I actually have a story about that. Um, so uh, for my wife's birthday, I gave her, like, this uh, st stupid, like, go... Not stupid, but, like, you know, like, all girly sort of spa day thing, right? And apparently she went to this place. I, I don't know it personally, but she was looking for this wine for a long time. Um, and one of the, and the places that she went was the place where they have the wine. Um, so <laughs> when we went to pick her up, she yeah. was like, oh yeah. Oh wow, dude, you're fucking nailing it. You're getting them all. Uh, she was like, oh yeah, I bought five bottles of this wine. And I'm like, oh, okay. Cool. Uh, so now we have all this wine. Quiet. It's tasty. But, yeah. Ooh, add two to a combat dex check. Mm. That's not bad. I'm going to discard it so that I can explore again. Hey, there he is. Yeah, oh, I fucking... I called it. See, didn't I say? Didn't I say? Mm. See, if Zippy was at this one, we could have closed both of them and been done with it. But now he has to run. So... Uh, we got plenty of time, so you can technically um, avoid this fight if you like. How much health? Do you I have? think I think I want to beat him. Can you because beat I both can of close... the attacks? Uh, you could hit him for one as long as I do the other one, because you have a ranged weapon. No, I don't. Throwing axe. Yeah, but that's not ranged. So it is axe ranged slashing magic. So how does, that, how does that work exactly? I have to do one of them. Oh, no, wait. It's an either or. I can do combat or divine. Oh. Uh, do divine then. <laughs> Slap that bitch in you. In your hole, man. Go oh, on. No, hang on. Oh. So before the encounter, choose a character at your location. That character summons and encounters a random monster. 
If there are no other lo characters at your location, the difficulty to defeat him is increased by 1d4. I'll roll low, bitch. Uh, right, well, first let's uh, summon and encounter a random monster. I encountered a goblin, goblin snake. Goblin snake. Succeed at constitution. Fortitude 6 check. Or the difficulty oh, of all your checks is increased by a further one. Luckily, I have plus three four. So, what do I need? A six plus three. Eight. There we go. Cool. Uh, now combat right. eight. So D six plus, plus a D2 ten plus ten. Yeah. All right, that's a pretty decent roll. What's that? Yeah, you got it. Yep. Cool. Goblin snake is fucking Goblin dead. Goblin snake is dead. Snack. That's what I call my penis. Goblin snake. Dead. Dead. Uh, arcane divine eleven. So I'm going to aid myself, which will give me an additional d6. I'm using my glaive, which gets me a d10. My melee is. Hold up. Hold. Hold. Hold the fucking phone. Someone said "fuck yeah" in my chat. And the auto mod's like, hold up. I don't remember having I an auto mod. Hate, I fucking hate auto mod, I swear to God. I it is the worst idea I've ever seen on Twitch. Why the why the hell Why the hell is it even on? I, I didn't even turn it on. Like The oh, best whoa. part is the person who said fuck yeah is one of your moderators. But you have to moderate your moderators now. No no, no it wasn't but a moderator, it was a sub. It was a sub, so. Oh, I yeah, I can only see Farrell's one because the auto mod obviously blocked the other one. Yeah. It's yeah, no, it is so fucking stupid. I hate it. I wish that they would not be doing. Wait, it. is there an option somewhere that I can turn that shit off? Because I don't remember turning it on. Unless they've just like, yeah, let's just turn it on. See who keeps it on. It's all good. It's all good. I've just never seen that before. Moderation. Uh, so I recharge my A. Allow all messages on videos except those caught by auto mode. What? You know what's uh, super funny? It only works most of the time. That's, a, you know? that's literally the first time I've ever seen it happen. Yeah, like I'll have somebody pop in my chat and be like, oh yeah, fuck yeah. And then it'll be like auto mod. And it's like people say fuck in my chat all the time. Dude, I have an, I have an, I have an 18 maybe, plus maybe, rating on my board. They... Like, Maybe they actually like specifically do it for newer people, like people who haven't been in the channel for very long that come in and say fuck. It's like, oh, are you sure? Are you sure you want to say that in here, dude? Mm. Oh yeah, maybe because it's like I don't know. It's it's really weird because somebody would be like, oh man, that guy's a bitch, you know, and then it'll be like auto mod. It's like, well, though yeah, you shouldn't be calling somebody a bitch because that's kind of rude. But then again. <laughs> What if they deserve I mean, <laughs> I mean, yeah, but it, it's kind of like, okay, whatever. I'm okay with it. I do know that I set up auto mod for very, like, specific words, you know, just say like, these words. Like swapping what? the word lemonade for zippy? Yeah, fuck, fuck lemonade. Fuck lemonade. All right, what are you? What are you? Should be all about that, Doctor Pepper. Uh, so I got a two d six and a d ten plus mm -hmm, two. Mm -hmm. I can re-roll if I fail it. Do it. Do uh, it. And this is yeah, plus. No, no, no. You got to roll a d four to see the extra difficulty. Yeah. Uh. Yes. Right. Sorry. Ah, oh, three. So you need a fourteen. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's it's within it's within grass, reason. I can re-roll if I fail it. Here, here we go. I'm I'm clericking, guys. Oh boy, oh boy. Eleven. Oh, that's a seven. Okay, I thought you got one, one, three. <laughs> no. Uh, that's not enough. That is not enough. Nope. Uh. Wait, you got a plus three on your divine, right? It's melee. But it's. I hit. I hit a thirteen. No, it's... are you doing combat? Well, yeah, I'm using my glaive. You have oh, wait, no. and a divine, Shit. dude. What are you doing? Well, no, because that'd still be a D12 plus two, but I don't have a, a arcane divine to, to enhance that in any way. You just roll your divine trait, dude. 
You've got it on your character sheet. You can just roll wisdom plus divine. You don't need anything to make that happen. Right. And if I rolled that, it'd be a d12 plus three, right? And that's it. It'd be a d12 plus three, and then... That's it. I... I mean, you could use holy light. Do you see what I mean? Like, I don't have anything to enhance that d12 yeah. plus three, whereas yeah. I have weapons and things. You have holy light. He's not undead. You still get a 2d6 out of it, then. You get a d12 plus three plus 2d6. Oh, shit. I thought that only worked on undead. No. And the undead gives you an extra 2d12. Well, you're doing combat well, now, so you already rolled, so... Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, uh, so technically, you need to beat a 20. Because <laughs> it's, it's... No, 19. Uh, 19. 19. I need to beat a 19. On a... Mm, that is... Yeah, you a could I, do I need it. to beat a 19 on a 21. It's technically possible. I mean, I'm going to take the damage, so I may as well discard the glaive and hit him again. All right, do it, man. Nope. Oh, 14. Eh, no. All right, so okay, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't like my chances at beating him anyway, and I take one damage. Okay, you took an extra turn, asshole. All right. Okay, uh, my turn. Yep. Um, Zippy, you there, man? So, I think you and me might need to go to the mill, and you will need to be the one that does the acrobatic closing check on this thing, because uh, you're the only one that can make okay. that check. Um, so, yeah, uh, I'm gonna go to the mill and do some exploring. Uh, Grindy low. Aberration goblin aquatic veteran. <laughs> Grindy low may not be evaded. The difficulty to fit Grindy low is increased by the adventure deck number current scenario. So he is a 16 to beat. Okay, that's not too bad. I'm going to use Horse Chopper. Yeah, Horse Chopper. I, I like that the, uh, the Grindy low has a little goblin song on it as well. Oh, Mummy Squid, soft and tough. S salty, tough. Uh, tasty because they fight so rough. But if I squish, if squish have goblin grin, run like hell, he ain't your kin. Oh, yummy, not mummy. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing, I'm guessing the Grindelow is some kind of aquatic goblin squid monster that yeah. looks like goblins to draw other goblins in and then eats them. All right, so this is uh 1d8 plus 1d10 plus. Four plus five. Um, Elven breastplate uh, plus a D six, so this is plus six. Uh, uh, plus two because you're using slashing at the mill. Oh, I am sweet. Uh, so that's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, fuck this Grindelow. Get out of here, you nerd. Right. Um, and that's all I can do. Okay. Um, okay. Zip, you're up, my man. All right. I'm going to come over to you and be mm -hmm. like, what up, my dude, my dude, my dude, my dude, my dude. What up, my dude, my dude, my dude, my dude. And I'm going to be like, kabam, skeleton horde. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't. Oh, no, I have a Warhammer. We're good. We're good. We're good. Do you have a mace or something? Uh, which one is it? Ancient skulls. Ancient I got scaly it. bro. Yeah, we I got, got it. Lightning touch. Uh, okay, so it's increased by three. Uh, oh, I know you're using lightning touch. Okay, so you can go first then. You need a d4? Yeah. All right. Twelve. Twelve. You're good. Um, I need to beat an eight. Uh, so I'm going to use. Where's that other D8 gone? It's over there. Okay. Um. I need to get a heal, if you could, um, Doc. 
<laughs> what do I look like, a cleric? What do I look like? Someone who has a thing? Ah, oh, we're good. Uh, I still have to fight him yet. No, each character... Oh, open location. I thought it was just this location. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and yeah. fight it, man. I have nothing to fight it with. Can I hit it with my Staff of Healing? Uh... So I get a D6 plus 2. So what happens um... if you fail it? I'll take damage from him. Oh, that's it? Okay. Yeah. Um... I'm going to go ahead and use a blessing, I guess, because... You don't want to take damage? Yeah. 2d6. Yeah, because I'd, I'd rather lose one blessing than take damage and lose all of them. Yeah, yeah there do. we go. You wouldn't have made it anyway. Yeah. All right, cool. All right. So, you're up. Can you give me a sweet, salty heal? Wait. Uh, what up? Wait, wait, I wait, hold up. Oh, you can keep so, going? Okay. Uh, of course. It yeah. was Zippy's turn. What were we thinking? Hold on. Tech magic. <laughs> Auto recharges. Oh, no, no. Zippy, you should spyglass before detect magic. No, no, no. I just want to I wanna double check. Okay, oh, so man. it's divine. Oh, wait. No, if it's divine, uh, it's a blessing. Or it has a magic trait, I immediately encounter it. Mm. Oh, it's a blessing okay. or it has a magic trait. Yeah, so you get it. So you can do wisdom on this one. So, yeah, 1d8. I mean, you just get it, because it's wisdom. Oh, yeah, is it? And your wisdom's plus three. three so, so you, you just need, get it. You need yeah. to roll a one or better. So you can discard yeah, that straight away and keep going if you want. Oh, wait, how is my wisdom plus three? He has a blessing in his hand. You're in has this ever happened? Oh, wait, no. You, sorry, your wisdom's a d8. right? Uh, yeah, my wisdom is just a simple d8. I just need yeah. to hit a four or better. I don't. Okay, so it goes off to the wayside. Uh, let's... Reveal to see if it's a spell. It is not, so it goes right here. Uh, this gets recharged. Seals are officially dog mermaids. All right, and then I'm going yeah. to... Uh, actually, yeah. I'm going yeah, to Spyglass. Spyglass lets you reveal the top two cards. Wait, half plate. Is that just normal half plate? Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's basic half plate. Basic bitch half plate. Do, do any of y'all need those? Put them back in any order. So they yeah. have to go in any order. Um, but no, we don't need them. They're garbage. Okay. Right? So it doesn't I think I have better armor now. I can't even remember. I think I had like the magic chainmail, didn't I? Mm -hmm. and then yeah, no, I, I gave you all my magic chainmail. Yeah. Knight's Watchman to explore. explore. Reveal that there's a dagger and Dexterity roll my D6 for you. D6. You get it? All right. I get it. All right. Um, now it's the end of my turn. Yeah. No. Cool. All right. Doc. I'll give you a thing. Yo. Heard you wanted some fat heels. The fattest, please. Yeah. All right. Uh. I have to be in your location to do that. Yeah. Oh, if you move or moved here, discard a card. Okay. Uh, Wait, can you use the, the wand from anywhere? Uh, at your location. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can move to you and still heal you. Yeah, well, I kind of need I'm... it. I've only got three left, so... Yeah. I won't be able to... If right, I so take any I'm damage... Yeah. I will... Burn my staff of minor healing to do a major healing. That's right. So four. I have five. five six. Six, yes, six, six. Have six. Yes. Two, three, four, five, six. All right. Let's take a look. Flip. Search. All right. I have two blessings in here, which means I have a total of. Uh, Six, five, four blessings in a nine deck. Okay. So it's mostly weapons. <laughs> Alright. Um, I guess I will explore because I know what it's going to be. Yeah. So. Armor. Boop. 
Hello, armor. Hey, Alden Foxglove. Banish this to succeed in acquiring a weapon, armor, or spell. Yeah, thanks. All right. Yeah. You want to keep going? Um, I don't have a weapon. Uh, what is that? I could banish this to reduce all damage dealt zero, but you should, should probably up. heal yourself next turn. Actually. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I, sh I might. I might do that. I right. might actually end it there. We're we're, we're doing actually really well. We're, yes. we're down to two locations. We've got 18 cards left. So and there's only I'm there's okay. only nine more explorations we need to do. So technically, unless someone shits the bed. Yep. Right. So I will end my turn there. Okay. Exploration. What's on the bottom? Uh, oh, okay. Look. Now I'm equipped to fight. Deals so one force damage to you, then after deals one damage to you. Okay. So I will... Um, it's increased by the scenario, so it goes up by four, so it's 12 to beat. So I'm going to use the horse chopper. I'm going to take one damage by getting rid of my throwing axe. Um, I am going to... Okay. Get a d6 on that. So this is plus six. Uh, actually, it's plus eight because it's at this location. Yep, eat dead as fuck. And then I take one more damage. You, you weren't enchanted by her feminine wiles? I am feminine wiles, so... I'll get rid of the warhammer. Um, and then I will burn my blessing to keep exploring. Soldier. Okay. Charisma Diplomacy. Which for me is a D10. Um, okay. Add a D6 to that. So it's plus one. Okay. I discard it to keep exploring. Okay. Mystic Inscription. Uh, if defeated, add one D4 random spells from the box to your hand. Oh. So I think um, it might be worth. That's really good. Yeah, it might be worthwhile throwing some help at this. Um, can you use the Archelite uh, on other people's checks? No, your, your check. Uh, do you have anything that can help with other people's checks? Uh, unfortunately, no. No, he's, he's a wizard. He kind of just does his own thing. Um, I can give you a blessing. Okay, yeah, I think that might be worthwhile. So, what is it? Intelligence? Wait, how? Hold up. Before you use it, I'm rolling a d4, so it's not worth it. I can't make it. Uh, if undefeated, you may banish this barrier. Do you want to just leave it? I'll just actually leave it. Um. So it stays on top. No, I guess refresh. I believe. Nope, I guess refresh. Does it? Oh, it's a barrier. Yeah. Shit, my bad. I'm sorry, fellas. I'll search. I'm not going to say what's in there, though. But it's on top again. Yeah, I'm pretty sure barriers stay on top if they aren't defeated. Yep. All right. Okay, Zippy, would you like 1d4 random spells? I would love 1d4 random spells. Uh, so you got, what's your intelligence? D12 plus... One. Three, because it's arcane. Oh, three. I think you probably... Do you want, right. you want a blessing? Uh, wait, what does it need to be? Uh, actually, no, you can't have a blessing, because I need to fucking heal myself, man. Yeah. I need that. That's my only divine card. No, you know, you know what I'm going to do? You're going to use the Acolyte? I'm going to recharge the Acolyte to add a D4 to it. Is it D4? It's D4 for an arcane check. Recharge this card. Uh, wait. To recharge? Yeah, add 1D4 to your arcane or divine check. Oh, that's so to it's... recharge. Right. Okay, yeah. Yeah, and then the it has a second ability. Recharge it for uh, recharging your spell. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Not a D4, a D6 for a recharging spell, D4 for the check. So, so, yep. 
Yeah, you get I it. it. So add one d4 random spells. Four. Awesome, dude. Did you shuffle it? Yep. Uh, enfeeble. Mm. Enfeeble. Invisibility. Levitate. Basic. All basic. Levitate. What's this one? Mirror image. Oh, mirror image is. If a monster deals damage to you, you may display this card. Even if you played another spell on this check, roll 1d4. On a result other than 1, reduce the damage to 0. <laughs> wow, that's good. You're going to keep that one. <laughs> yeah, it's like armor. What for? Uh, do this each time a monster deals damage to you. Discard this card at the end of the turn. Okay, so you can just be in a monster mash and just like... Uh, you don't have to bury them all. You only have to bury one. Yeah. Uh, if you acquire a spell, bury a card. So you can keep so the I others. Guess. You but I'm, I'm acquiring four spells. No, if you acquire... Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, there's no specific wording, but I would take that as every spell is, requires a card to be buried. Yeah, I, I think that makes sense. So I actually need to bury one more so I'm going to bury the dagger. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, dagger. No one likes you. You don't right. need magic. You don't need magic. Uh, you don't need magic. So that was, that was my turn? Yep. That okay, was cool. Your explore. Uh, didn't you acquire a card with the magic trait during an exploration? I did. I did. So I can... <laughs> Masterwork tools, dexterity, which is a d6 for me. Yeah, you can't even get it, dude. So I don't even bother rolling. Um, actually, I might be able to. I just use mirror image, my man. I use mirror image so I can get it. Okay, so I don't. I I miss it, so it goes away. And then I'm going to detect magic, automatically recharges. Mm -mm. My name is Zippy Zippo, and I'm addicted to magic. I used to be a wizard until you've been blacklisted. There, there's the cultist. Okay, discard uh, Zitoad. Zitoad. Explore. Okay, well. Um, if you want, I can do this, or you can do magic. It's up to you. I can do this. Yep. All right, man. Go for it. I get a plus two on my slashing, so just letting you know. Um, oh, you did. Yeah, uh, he's a wizard. Yeah, I'm a wizard. Um, you oh, fucking A plus asshole. two to slashing. I remember when I used to use slashing weapons. Bladed weapons are so inelegant, and a Jedi shouldn't be seen with it. Blasters. I mean, I don't know the quote. <laughs> oh, I get rid of a lightning touch to get a lightning touch. Pew pew. Zippy's just being crazy right now. He's just doing. It's like I'm just throwing cards All everywhere, right. man. You're not even. So what do I got? What do we got to do to close the mill? Uh, succeeded dexterity acrobatics check eight. Yeah. Lol. Which right. is you. Fail. So no, you're the only one that can make it, dude. So we have to give you a boon. So you have to use oh. this thing um, to make it happen because he's the only one that can fucking do it. So you have to yeah. use it. It, it. Like there's um, no other way to do it. That's why I wanted to push the the uh, or, 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 or. We don't do it. You keep your thing. And we chase him. And we chase we him chase into him this back location. To here. That, yeah. that was the original plan. I'd rather not use that. I'm down to three hit points, so I'd like to heal. I think that's appropriate. Um, so... You can't make the check uh, unless you have some sort of acrobatics helper or something like that. No, what what we could do? How many cards are left in here? Three. Yeah, that's, um, that's what I mean. Like, it's not going to be that hard to close this one and have him come over here. That's what, yeah, that's that's the plan. We're going to move him over to this. Even one, if so. if if we close this one next turn, I can move in there. I'm okay with discarding a card, kind of deal, uh, and then I could nuke him. Yeah, I mean, yeah. What's in there? You found all the blessings, so it'd just be weapons and maybe. You Did you find any there. spells? Uh, he found a cure. Yeah, in there. I think it's. 
I yeah, think I found a cure. I think it's all. I found both the weapons. There's an item and a blessing in there. Plus, the last one in here would be a blessing, by the way. One hundred percent. Oh no, you, no, no! I, you found the blessing before, right? So no, it's not the blessing. Yeah, I got a. Uh, I got detect magic that will kind of let me stack the deck a bit. Actually, you know what? It is possible that he's in here. Hmm. Oh, do you just want to try it and see? I mean, you can beat this guy, right? Because not beating it is worse. So beat him so anyway. So there's one card in here, and there's a 50-50 chance it's him. I honestly think it's not worth blowing this, because you need to heal. Like, that's just how it goes. So Yeah, that's, okay, that's, that's my fine. only concern, is I'm down to three hit points. So I could so we don't close take it. a lot of time. Okay. All right, and but you can keep going I, if you want. Yeah. Well, I I recharge my hand and then pass turn. All right. Uh, you're up, my man. I will take a heal, thank you, cleric. Not a problem. I never ever told you how handsome you are. Thank you, cleric. Yeah. Uh, six. Not bad. I might need another healing pretty soon too. Maybe. Actually, I got plenty of armor. We should be okay. For a little bit so um what's the plan here who's going into what um i think all right so i have a bunch of armor me too uh no i'm i'm gonna say i could i could reveal this and if it's not the villain it doesn't matter if it is the villain i can just soak the damage he's gonna do to me but then he runs yeah and then we know exactly where he is no. in here oh because he can't be in the same deck, right? Makes sense. Okay, sure. Expose. Yo, wait, no, you I can't because you healed. You don't have anything to do. Oh, that's right. Yes. Uh, sure. Never mind that. That I guess ends with my turn. Unless should I? Yeah. No, I can't move. I'll move I'll ex no. I'll explore. It's fine. Um, okay. Unless I want to go over there and throw my chainmail in the bin, which wouldn't be so bad. I'm going to move. I'm going to move. I'm going to move. Uh, so, in order to move there, uh, I need to discard a card. Which I will do. And then I'll explore. Okay. There he is. Um, Alright. Um, Alright. Um, so... Roll a 1d4 to see how much more difficult it is. Okay. Well, first you have to summon an encounter, another monster first. Like, okay. That's the for the encounter. Cool. It's a plague zombie. Um, okay, so I just need to beat. So, uh, d10 plus d8 plus d6. Plus six. Yep. Yeah, she fucked. She dead AF. Um, I don't have to do anything. Cool. All right. Now, I rolled the D4, got a three, so he's technically a what? Uh, he is a 19 to beat. That's feasible for me uh, to do. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, I don't have a blessing. That's so. fine. I can still attempt. Um, and I'm going to add another D6 with this guy. Um, to my check. Um, and let's see what I get. Okay, cool. That recharges. Though, if I take any damage here, I'm basically going to die, so. Uh, you've always got your magic half plate. You can mm -hmm. banish that. So this is plus six. 23. Oh, yeah. He dead. All right, so he goes over here. Uh, no, he gets. Yeah. He gets blessing as well. Except no, 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 because there's no, it's... there's no other, there's no other open thing. Yes, but it still gets a blessing from a from the box, and then it shuffles, and they get split between the two. But no, because he was just at this one. He can't go back to this one. Are you sure? Yes, one hundred percent. I can even read the rules for you if you like. Because we didn't close this one, which is... 
I mean, it's impossible uh, to close that one, so. Uh, all right. So, let's take a look at the rules. Uh, okay. If defeat the villain, close a villain's location. You do not need to fulfill the closing document. Example, when the location deck, there is no additional villains in it. Banish all the oh, cards right, and flip it So over. you defeated him, so it's closed. Yes, that's what I'm saying. So, that goes here. Fair enough. Yeah. And uh, then what was left? Force missile and a blessing. Okay. Force missile's not great. So. All right. Uh, that's actually pretty good. 2d4. It's not bad. I mean, it's a basic one, though. Yeah, it's not. It's not a bad spell. It's... You can always get it. You can always get it out. You, like, there's no reason yeah. to encounter it. All right. Um, and uh, that's my turn. Zippy, you're up. And uh, sweet. Did your thingy, and I'm down to two HP left, basically. Yep. Uh, I'll get you a heal, assuming we don't end this on this. Turn. All right. So uh... the best thing about you two being in this location is that he doesn't get any difficulty added to him. Yeah. I'm going to discard Spyglass. To search? Yep. Mm. Ooh, a blessing. Maybe do the blessing first? Discard this card to, add to, to a check with a fire trait or to a check to defeat or acquire a card with the animal trait. That's pretty cool. Um... Discard to add two dice to it. So that would go really well with like flaming weapon. Yes, it would. But I, I would have to uh, make a five on the divine check. Actually, I don't have divine. I would have to hit a um, six on a constitution, and I roll a d4 for constitution. Hmm. So for me, just going for Justin uh, Ironbriar is... What I have to yeah, do. Yeah, okay. We might as well end this one. It's not a amazing blessing. I mean, yeah, it's, we'll be missing out on a blessing. Oh, no. Yeah. All right. Um, if there's no other characters in the location, roll a d4. There is. So no need to add. Are you going? What are you, you going still for? Need to, he still needs to encounter a monster first. So. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to. Uh... Enchanter. Okay. So it's a 12 to beat her. Uh, before the encounter, okay. you have to discard so, a card. Okay, I'm going to discard arcane uh, armor. Yep. I'm going to display toxic cloud. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I played a spell. Do I get anything off the top? I got a lightning touch. Uh, I'm going to roll to see if it recharges. Have you it ever wondered, recharge. like, a wizard's overpowered? So wait, <laughs> hang on. What does it do? It adds. It adds a one d six. Yeah. Uh, so that act all that actually stays out until the end of your turn okay so i'm going to lighten touch the enchanter which is 2d4 plus a d12 plus a d6 hey puppy what you doing yeah okay. so she fucking dies but you still take one fire one, damage one fire damage is. yep uh lightning touch recharges Sweet. Uh, and then she deals one damage to me? Right? Yep. Okay, discard Acid Arrow. Um, and then Briar is going to get a beautiful slap on the dude. Chunk to the face. 22. He's dead as fuck. Yep, he did. All right. Okay. So that's the end of that. Wait, do you get at this? No effect. Okay. So everyone gets a random spell from the box. Oh boy. What again? What would it be? Holy light. Okay. That's not bad. Uh, that's a good spell. Here goes it. Here's your random spell. I got a speed. Oh. Force missile. Speed. Hmm. Is that divine? Display a card and select the character. 
For the rest of the turn, add three to the character's checks that use a dexterity die. Uh. <laughs> uh, well, I mean... Uh, select this... Uh, for the rest of this turn... I mean, we're really bad at dexterity, and it comes up a lot, so... Discard yeah. this card at the end of the turn. You can just use it as a thing, but you're giving up an actual spell for that. Yeah, that's the that's the only problem. The only, I, I don't want to give up Holy Light. I don't want to give up Cure. Mm. All right. Um... These are all the cards that I don't need, and I'm ready for, for round two. All right, well, let's bring in another dude. All right, so um, I got to get rid of all of my shit. You want a holy light, Doc? I've got an extra one. Um, I think I'm better off getting rid of speed and just keeping aid instead, because aid is 1d6 to any check. Speed is adds three to a, a dex check, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'll, I'll get rid of speed if anybody wants it. It's right there. All right. Uh, another holy light. Um, I don't know. Maybe maybe replace cure. Because holy light is divine. I can always use that for my yeah. ability thing, you I can. guess. Yeah. That sounds better. All right. Seven blessings. Check. Two allies. <clears throat> Incorrect. Um, so I want to keep the sheriff of Hemlock and the Night Watch. Actually, I'll keep a soldier. Yeah, fuck the night watch. I'm taking the soldier, dude. Get out of here, bitch. Anyone want a night watch? Zippy, maybe you want to change your thing? Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I actually have everything that I need. All right. Uh, one spell. Okay, that's good. Uh, seven blessings. All right. So three armor. And all right, so I have a night watch and a burglar to give up. I also have a bunch of weapons. Hear ye, hear ye. Come get weapons. I'm keeping the icy long spear. I'm throwing away. Keep that. Okay, I'm throwing away a short sword plus one, which is uh, d6 plus uh, your w d6 plus one. Uh, but you need a proficiency with weapons, so. I don't know if you want that or not, Doc. I'm also throwing away the returning throwing axe plus one. If you wanted to take that as your weapon instead of the dog slicer. Because it's the same. Oh, well, you got a plus one on your strength, actually. So that would be different. Did you want to take... I um, know oh, you need proficiency to use it. Okay. To use what? I, the short sword. Uh, and you need a proficiency actually, with the throwing axe as well. So. I have proficiency. I was talking about CP. Uh, no, if, if you're throwing away the short sword. Yeah, I am throwing away the short sword in favor for the horse chopper, dude. Absolutely. That's yeah, fucking that would That would be better than my mace, if you want. I'll yeah, but maces are good gladly. for bludgeoning, so just keep that in mind. Yeah, but if I encounter something that needs bludgeoning, mm -hmm. I'm a cleric, and it's probably undead. All right, well, I'm throwing the rest of these away, then. Uh, I have nine blessings. Holy shit. Okay. Um, you don't need this armor? I think... Uh, no, I'm putting these up here. These are the ones I'm, like, not wanting. Do you want speed, Zippy? All right, uh, what's this card? Oh, these are all the spells that he doesn't want. Wow, you picked up eight spells that you didn't want to keep for this round, Zippy? Jesus Christ. Uh, nope. There's three blessings there, Henley, if you want to see if you want any of those. Oh, yeah, okay. Um... 
So what are, I don't what... know if you kept your throwing axe, but there's a plus two to combat dex check there. To a combat dex check. Oh, I don't need combat dex. Um, Non-combat constitution check. I might keep that one. Sounds interesting. Uh, I'll get rid of a blessing of the Torag for it. Okay. Yeah. I'm just going to go grab a drink. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, so let's uh, let's sort out this deck then. Uh, we don't need this guy. And what's this last one? Blessing. Get out of here, Blessing. Uh, so we just flip this over and bring this on. How many Blessings do we need for four people? Flip, 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 flip. All right. Hello. What up? What up? How you do, do? I'm doing great. So, you've played this before, I assume? You know how it works? Uh, someone? Okay. No. I'll send you the pa password. I haven't cleared the game as long as you have. What was that? I haven't cleared the game as long as you have. Uh, it doesn't change. <laughs> Any idea on what class you want to be? Uh, if the rogue is still available, I have had plenty of luck with the rogue. You Oh, okay. Yes, the rogue is still available. 100%. I'm surprised we had bad luck with the rogue. Um, I mean, we had good luck with yeah. right, I guess we can make space over here. That's really the only place that we can fit him, so. Um, okay. Click all these. Uh, I just need a garbage bag, I think. Games, objects, components. Where's the containers? Yeah, it should be in game now. Okay. Where you want me to be? Just uh, next to Zippy would be fine. It's probably the easiest place to go. Um, miscellaneous, maybe. I'm looking for. A, I'm looking for the bucket. I don't know where the bucket is or the bu the bag. This one? No, that's not it. Tools. There it is. Uh, okay, so so we'll give you the basic deck. Um, you know what you want for your character? Uh, as the character, I want Masil. Masil, Masil, and there should be should be another. I have returned. Welcome back. He's playing the rogue. <laughs> oh no! Uh, so do you know where the cat hang on? No, hey, hey, isn't she dead? Technically, so... I'm, I'm, I'm just new. What are you missing? You're missing cards, powers, skills. Maybe you don't have four. Ah, uh, no, that's it. She only had the one. She only had the one. Because she has she has two powers, but one of them is just literally you may invade the encounter, so it's only a small thing. Okay. Um. So for your basic card deck, for you, um, you need the following. Uh. Okay. Dagger dart. So if you wanna. Right, hang on. Dart. Dagger. Um, I don't know where 
dagger is. Oh, there it is. Dagger. Uh, you need leather armor. So those up at the edge, are those the one who stepped? What? Those up here at the edge, is still have stepped? I, I don't know what you're saying. Are these guys stepped? No, no, no. They're yeah. just characters. Um, all right, Caltrops. Caltrops, what else you need? Uh, crowbar. You need a uh, potion of glibness. Um, potion of vision. Potion of vision. There it is. Um, 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 uh, thieves tools too. One. And two. And then you need a blessings of the gods for or oh, ally burger gu guard. Are you searching for those? When? Uh no, sorry, I had to get a new ally out. I used mine. Okay. That uses your blessings. And you need a burglar and a guard. Burglar and a guard. Get, 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 guard. What do the guards look like? That's night watch. Uh, there's one in the top row, second card. Ah, uh, second from the top, second card. Oh, yeah. I would pull it out, but you can't because there's two people searching and that's a thing. All right, so yeah, just uh, stack all that together and that's your deck for at least now. You, you're At the end of this, you'll get whatever you want, basically. Okay, yeah. um, so now we're on to 2-5. So that can go over there. All right, uh, Angel in the Tower. Okay. Uh, so we need Scarecrow, Golem, and Charmed Faceless Stalkers. Uh, okay. Charmed Faceless Stalker. There's six of them. And... This is the... Ooh. Okay. Oh, wait. Sorry, I think I pulled them from the wrong bag then. Adventure 2, right? Yeah, that's right. Shadow Clock is open and no characters there. The end of turn, discard the top. Oh, wow, that's gross. Um, loot. Okay, so these are the loot we get at the end. All right. Uh, wait, is that the boss? Scarecrow Golem. Okay, I don't know where Scarecrow uh, Golem is. It might villain be. Zanesha, so that's her. Yeah. Scarecrow Golem and the charred face. Oh, I'll find that Golem. Okay, you find the Golem? Okay. Oh, fine. Yep. yep so yep, these yep. are the rewards then at the end. Okay, good to know. And how many locations do we need for four people? Uh, all right, Shadow Clock, we needed. Uh, so that's that one. We need Temple and Throne Room. What you need, Ronan? T -t Temple. T -t Throne room. Temple. Uh, so, Shadow Clock Temple, the Shrine to the Mushta. Hold on, I'm trying to find Temple right now. I don't know where it is. It's out. You just pulled it out. Uh, what was the other one? Shrine to the Mushta. No, the one before that. Temple. Before that. Shadow Clock. Okay, Shrine to Mushta. Okay, thank you. 
I, I don't know. I, I for some reason I was looking for throne room. I don't know why. It's there, but you know, shine through a moisture, all right? Okay. What's the next one? City gate. City gate. Uh, and the next one, throne room. Throne room. Throne room. Uh, what's throne room look like? Oh, okay. Uh, look at throne room. Got it. And the mill. And mill. That's it. Yep. Okay. Oh, okay. We've actually got a lot of locations now. How many um, bonus decks do uh, uh, thingies do we need for four people? Blessings. I mean. Is it an extra 10? Uh, no. We've got an extra player, so don't we get more blessings? Well, no, that would make the game considerably easier. Mm. Create a blessing. 30 random blessings from the box. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Ah. <laughs> there's, there's, we get ah. less turns each, but the same amount of overall turns happen. So. Ah. Okay. Ah, yeah. Then. Ah. Yeah. I get you. So we need a uh, scarecrow and her. And we need four. Uh, one scarecrow, the boss, and four of the other. Um, All right, so let's set up now. So, monster. Hold up. Okay, two monster walls. Sundaria. Two. Spell. Renan, please stop winning. <laughs> Collision. Okay, so you're doing. You can just you can just click it and right click extra cards. So, yeah. You know, no, if you if you take off the one off the top, and then right click. I don't know. I can't do that. Okay, hold up. Hold. Up. Stop. 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 Damn it. Okay. Not touching, not touching. So you take one off, you flick it off like you were doing before, and then you right click a bunch and it will just add more cards to your hand. Mm -hmm. so nice and easy. Uh, okay, so barrier. Uh, spell. And three blessings. Okay. So that one's done. Nine, 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 nine. Okay, that's it. Yep. That's it. Okay. Um one, two, three. All right, so we've got a new beat down stick to beat some sticks down with. Um, what is what's the assassin's abilities again, or the rogue's ability? She can evade. Uh, she can evade, and if she's the only character at her location, she may recharge a card to add one d six to her combat check, or discard to add an additional d six. Oh, if she's the only person at the location, I didn't recognize that. Yeah. What up, so man? she can. She can backstab or something, I guess. That's what that's supposed to represent. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Or be it's sneaky backstab. or something. I don't know. No, it's backstab. Oh, okay. All right. Zippy, you there, man? Yep. Sorry. Cool. 
Right. I kind of feel like I'm going to be starting at the Shadow Clock. Yeah, so the Shadow Clock location is open and no character is there. At the end of the turn, discard the top card of the Blessings deck. What do we do with the rewards, by the way? If we're not there? Uh, put them at the top here just to get them out of the way. Cool. All right, so uh, someone always needs to be at the Shadow Clock. And look at what it happens there, though. At the start of your turn, recharge your hand and draw up to your hand size. I'm the only one that can consistently take that kind of damage and heal it. Recharge right. isn't taking damage, though, really. Recharge your hand is discard everything, put it back at the bottom of your deck, and draw a new hand. Yeah, so you just discard your whole hand and then draw up, so it doesn't... Oh, no, discarding is different from recharging. Recharging goes back yeah, into the... recharge goes at the bottom of your deck. Um, okay. You, you clear out your hand, and then you draw up, so... You need to banish it's... an ally when you close, though, so... Yeah, I have an ally. Would you prefer to be constantly cycling through your stuff? Because like no. you hold your things. No, I, I want to keep Zippy, my things. Zippy won't really want to, I don't think. Because uh, actually, Zippy might be able. It wouldn't really matter to him. Um, He's just going to draw a handful well, of spells again. Where's the spells? Well, there's a lot of spells at the temple, I guess. And there's also a lot at the throne room. At the start of your turn, you may recharge an item to draw a card. Who has the most items? I think that needs to be the rogue then at the throne room. Uh, the yeah, thing. I literally have one item, so. Yeah, I think that's you. I think you need to go to the throne room there, Malaya. Uh, but I would, uh, unless guys. either of you has a high dex pro, I think I might actually be better. Actually, yeah. guys. Yeah, what's up? I I gotta to do this, but the uh, people who were doing work uh, showed up, so I need to go deal with them. Uh, if you guys want to just kind of take over my character. It, well, we're just starting. It, we might as well just drop down. Yeah. So. Okay, sure. All right. Thanks, thanks guys. Sorry about that. No I'll catch you later. This is going to be annoying. All right, so we lose the mill. Yep, so just look through uh, there and see if the henchman's there. Yeah. Actually, the, the, the either... Okay, no, it's good. Yeah, it's so he, he needs... No, this needs to still be in at the... Okay, um, well, here, let me just search one. Um, cool. Yep, so then I'll pull out all the rest of the henchmen out of these things, so. Pull out all the henchmen, basically. That's what you need to do. And try not to look at the cards. Okay, so how many do we have? We need Okay, so we have five, so we have that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we got everything, cool. Alright. So shuffle it all again. Easy. Easy fix. Alright. So no mill. So you don't have to worry about going there. So I guess the all next right, one well, is the runner. Alright. Uh, the Shrine to Lamauso, uh, I might go there. If you encounter a blessing, you are dealt two points of mental damage that may not be reduced. Ooh. That's Divine Six to close, though, so... Alright, let's roll a D6 to see who goes first. I got a four. Four. Alright, I'm rolling again. Five. Okay, I go first. You go first. All right, so I will go here. I'll go there, do the blessing stuff. Close it out. Uh, Doc, you're going to go where? The shadow? Yeah. yeah, I think I probably should. Like, I cycle my cards often enough, but it's not going to hurt me to recharge my hand. All right, here we go. Shadow. Shadow's immune to mental and poison. Uh, if the check does not have a magic trait, which I do, yeah, Shadow's undefeated. Okay, 13 damage. Okay, so uh, Warhammer is D8 plus D8. And cool, got a blessing. You get a D6. Actually, I'm going to start at the city gate. Well, hold up, why? Because I can move before I explore, and I don't have to recycle my hand before my first turn. 
Uh, is it turn when it gets back to me, or is it turn when I finish? What do you mean? For this. Uh, and no character is at the is at, at the. Oh, okay, yeah, because I'd have to sit. There. I'd I'd be out for two turns. Yeah, okay, so I stay there. Yeah. Um. All right. Cool. So uh, this is going to be D eight plus D eight plus D six plus six. Because I'm a healthy young paladin. All right. That's easy. Cool. Goodbye. All right. Um. I am going to throw away, what's this one do? Non-combat charisma, non-combat strength. I'll get rid of my blessing of Toa and we'll keep going. Cool. Yep. You more automatically acquire it. I take two damage though. Uh, yes, so I take two damage. Uh, that may not be reduced, so I'm going to get rid of this and this. One of those can actually be the blessing you just acquired. Oh, it can be? I mean, you acquire it. Yeah, and then I'm gonna. Then, I'm just gonna use it to keep searching. So. Yeah. All right. How many monsters are in here? Three. All right. So I already fought two of them. Found defeated. Bury one random item or weapon from your discard pile. <laughs> okay. Uh. Well, let's do the. Do you want a blessing? Nah, I'm Take okay. it. I'm gonna get rid of it at the end of my turn anyway. <laughs> oh really? I I'm, I have to recharge my hand at the start of my turn, so it's not like I'm gonna be able to use it. Interesting. Okay, then. Plus six. Yeah, he's dead. Uh, I also didn't want you to have to bury your icy long spear. Yeah, well, I already did it by the time that you rolled around, so I'll keep that in mind for next time. Okay, that's me. Um, so I will go get three more upgrades. Okay, that's not bad. I have some options. Oh, there you go. You got your horse chopper back. Ah, my horse chopper. Guess that's my turn now. Yep. I'm just gonna... Ah, oh, sorry, yep. Oh, there she is. Alright, so hold well, up. Let's temporarily close this place. Succeed a divine six or banish a blessing. Uh, I'm gonna do a divine six check. Which for me is D eight plus two. Uh six. Um Okay, cool. Add an extra D six to that. Plus one. It's... This is plus three. Uh, yeah, we're good. So that's okay. temporary closed. Uh what about you, Doc? Banish an hour. No out. can do. No can do? Okay. Nope. So it can go to a possible three locations after you beat her. Um, so yeah, go ahead, beta. Uh, combat 14. Cool. I have no weapons. Uh, well, you have wisdom, right? What's your wisdom? This one is D6. D6 plus nothing. Um, plus my blessing of the god, which is 2D6. Do you want to use another blessing, Doc? Because you have to get rid of him anyway, right? Sure. Uh, uh so... Yeah. Uh, you are the only character at your location. You may recharge a card to add one to six to your combat check. Uh, you make a point. Let me. So fourteen for combat. So, yeah. Well, yeah, that that's enough. Right? So you're rolling combat, which is a D eight. Um. Yeah. So D eight plus a D six plus a D eight. So you're rolling 2d8 plus 6. There you go. Okay. And you gotta be at a. I can, I, can, I, can, I can discard it to get one more and one an extra d8. Wait, 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 what? What, what, what? I can discard my card to get an uh, extra d6. You, so that's where d6. that d6 came from. Yeah, but that's if I recharge it. Yeah, he can recharge to get 1d6 or next discard time. to get 2d6. So you're discarding? Okay. Yeah. 20. Yeah, you get it. Uh, it's 20. I get it. So um, now we add... Th what did we say? Three? Yeah, three extra blessings. So. Uh, he has to beat her again. Really? I do? Yeah. 
it's wisdom 10 or oh. combat 14 then combat 7 Dang. okay well good luck uh, I can use my oh is it it's d8 I want d8 building up the guards I discarded to get another d8 Mm-hmm. Then I can. What do I need? The least I think I can discard the guard for two extra d sixes. Uh, anything else I can do and get? No. No. That's that. Wish me luck. Eighteen. Yeah. Uh. Yep. Just. I got it. Okay, so uh, now she goes in this pile. That's closed. So, what happens when it no, closes? No, I need to succeed. No, a... it just closes. Uh, if you defeat the villain, it just automatically closes. Just closes. Oh. Uh, no effect. Start of this turn, you turn, you may recharge an item to draw a card. Okay, um, so these all get discarded. What was in there? Time of knowledge, chainmail, cure, longbow plus one. Well, that would have been interesting to have. Uh, dagger, bugbear, siren. Okay, nothing decent. Okay, so one here. No, yep. Wait, why did we have. Uh, hold up, sorry, that's wrong. Okay. I'm just gonna stop doing stuff now. Okay, should only be three open. Two, three. Okay, that was on me. That was my beat. All right. Okay. All right, we're good now. Whew. Easy peasy. And I can't do anything else. So you draw back up, and then you get. Yep. All right, Doc. You're up, man. Okay done my blessing and now I recharge my hand you have to recharge every single time yep at the start of my turn recharge your hand and draw up to your hand size so I will always have five cards at the start of my turn so I don't mind throwing blessings out like a madman that's actually not a bad deal that was not the button I meant to press Oh, you mean you mean this button? Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Man, look at those blessings. Well, guess who's doing blessings. a lot of exploring? Mm. <laughs> uh, no ally though. You still right. have mending in your deck, bro? Yep, yep, yep. All right, flippy flip flop. Cool, that's good. Uh, holy light, right? It's an aberration. Does that count? Uh... Okay, undead only. Okay, so you yep. get a T12 plus 2 plus 2D6. Uh, so I need a wisdom 7. So no, you're going to get... Uh, it's a D... Yeah. Hang on. Uh, wait. Uh, plus 3, so six, 6. 6, so he's increased by 2, so I need a 13. So if you use Holy Light, you'll be rolling 1D12 plus 2D6 plus 3. Do we need a blessing off the guy? No. No, I don't think he does. Uh, yeah. If undefeated, deals no damage, bury the top card. If defeated, you may immediately attempt to close, like, which I can't. Uh, okay. Uh, Do you guys need a blessing off the guy? No. Uh, should be okay. Uh, 13. So which is yep, all you needed, yeah. Cool. So that guy just uh, uh, gets thrown in here, yeah? But you can't... Divine 8 charge. No, nope. I don't. Some bitch. Some bitch. It doesn't matter, though. Yeah, I mean, matter. it could have been better. All right. So now you just get to explore willy-nilly, yeah? Find yep. some... So uh... I'm going to explore. There's no allies in here. <laughs> if defeated, you may immediately explore again. If undefeated, you adult 2d4 combat damage. Wisdom 9, I think, is my best bet. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, let's see how it goes. Seven. Seven. Eight, nine. Eight. That's 
Wait. For divine, I have wisdom seven plus one is eight. Oh, right. Okay. You only have a plus one. Hmm. Yeah. So you I take. I defeated 2d4 combat damage. You can okay. reduce that, though, if you want. Oh, wait. No, you can't. Oh, discard this card to add two dice to a check to defeat a barrier. Fuck. I mean, you can still discard it and add two dice. It doesn't change the result of your seven. Yeah. That's true. But that would add two additional d12. Right. Well, let me, let me just double check if you can add something at the end. I don't think you can. I, no, I, I'm I pretty sure you, you have to do it beforehand. Yeah, I'd accept that rule. Uh, so I don't have anything to reduce that at all. So I'm going to take... Uh, what is it? At two? least two. I oh, yeah, no, all your cards. Three. Boom, boom. Wow. Rough. <laughs> okay, so that stays there. Um, uh, no, no. If undefeated, I'm dealt 2d4 damage, but it doesn't remain. Yeah, it's, it's still a barrier. It's still a barrier. That's what happens when you when you can't pass a trap's thing. It stays there. Okay, cool. Uh, uh, that's end of my turn. Uh, let's take a look real quick. <sighs> All right. Um, let's see. Eh, eh, eh. I'm pretty sure it stays up. I'm, I'm. Pretty sure it stays up. Mm -hmm. Pretty sure Girthy. it stays up. McLaughlin with the girth. Thank you, sir. All right. Uh, so one, two, three. So you've given me a thingy. Oh, no, it's back to me again, right? So. Oh, wow. Mirror image. Pity I can't fucking get it. My intelligence is garbo. Um, so. I'd give you a blessing, but I won't. Nah, don't worry about it. I don't need it. So nothing happens. No, I don't have any. Um, so that goes in, in the butthole. Um, and I will throw away a blessing to keep searching. Bugbear. The last monster in this deck. Undefeated, bury one item. Okay. Uh, let's see here. I am going to use my horse chopper, which is a D8 plus a D10. Um, plus a D6 plus 6. For 12, uh, which is 18. Nice. Dead as fuck. And out of me. Uh, uh, just where do you want me to go? Wherever you like, man. Uh, whatever you think you'd be best at. Honestly, right now, we just need to make sure that we can close locations. So, um, yeah, so if I can go over here, it'll be closed automatically. Uh, you have to beat the henchman first, though. So, no, if when closing, you may close this. Yeah, well, if you if we find the henchman or uh, the villain, mm -hmm. it's closed. Uh, what would you prefer to get, though? Would you want items? Because there's items in this deck, and there's no items in that one. Can you use Blessing Bless as your character? Me. You can, yeah. I can? You have four Blessings uh, in your hand, so... Yeah, you can use them. Um, yeah. You could go there. That wouldn't be a problem. I can go there and... Flip. Guidance. Guidance. Wisdom might actually have a chance to get that my wisdom is d6 to add one to a check <laughs> oh god why would anyone want that all right yeah you get six. it six there you go i nice. got it okay and i can discard my blessing of the gods to explore again all right you get hey! that. discard that uh is there any to... problems with that uh Okay, uh, you need to discard a card, by the way, because you moved uh, to the temple. I can discard one of my thief tools, then. Uh, yep. uh, discard one of my 
leads to any character you can give me evade and counter. Oh, well, yeah. that's nothing. Uh, discarded my the new Blessing of the Gods, which make me Flip again. do that. Okay. And hey, that's a Scarecrow. You may not play spells with the attack trait. Oh, look at that shit. <laughs> if defeated, you immediately attempt to close the location. I have no problem. With Imagine that. Zippy trying to fuck with this guy. I, t I told you it would happen at some point. Those dudes would start showing up. <laughs> and he doesn't even, he's not even here. He's not even here. Uh, I don't have a blessing. I can give you aid. You can give me one. Aid. I'll give you a 1d6. But what I can't do is magic. No, it's only... Oh, it's actually... Okay. It's only spells, so... Girthy. It's actually spells. Um, I have a blessing myself, so... Exploding be... dice, thanks for the hose, My man. 2d8. What are you using? You don't have a weapon? I don't have a weapon on me. So you are using... Uh, it's strength. 2d8, if I'm... Which is 2d8. Uh, so you, you get one for your strength, and you get one for Doc. Then you get one more. You can for... also recharge or discard for additional damage because you are the only person there. Mm -hmm. I can discard that so that um, this in two d six. Yep. Wait, did I get? Didn't I get a d six from uh, Dark? No, you get a d eight. Uh, it get... adds one d six. Oh, one d six. It's not a blessing. Oh, you weren't eight. using a blessing, right? Okay. Yeah, if you don't manage to kill a fucking twelve combat with that, I don't know if you'll ever do anything. And again, it's it's seen, more I've... a case of I just want it closed. That's <laughs> well, twenty-one. It's good enough. Yeah. Uh, so that closes. If you want to close it, you don't have to close it, but you can if you want to. Uh, I can close it. Okay. Then I can get all my items at the other place. So. Uh, so what happens at this? No effect. No effect. Uh, okay. All right. So nothing happens there. So let's see what's in here. Horse missile, garbage. Oh. Blessing, garbage. Star knife. Mm. <laughs> That's not how you pronounce shuriken. <laughs> That's not how you pronounce shuriken. Man. Hey, look, weapons. That's a shark. Heavy crossbow. Yeah, it's still basic, I guess. I don't know. Oh, that's a D10. Yeah, that's not so bad. Amulet of Fortitude. One die. One Okay, that's not so bad. That would have been pretty cool. All right. Neato. Actually, no, that's quite good, because that's just reveal. Yeah. But how often do fortitude checks really come up? Not a lot. You to be one of holding that in your hand. Not a lot, yeah. Well, I mean, like, I can't even carry items on me, so I don't give a fuck about that shit. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, that's my turn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Dog flipper, blessing, uh, and happy turn, my man. Alright, I will flip a blessing and recharge my hand. Mm. How novel. What did you get? Everything cool. good? Alright, so I'm going to... You can heal yourself with that mend, I guess. Yeah, I'm going to use my mending to give myself a heal. I will heal for five. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Nice. Worst thing's been done to better people. So. Uh, I love I love pistachios, man, but sometimes it can just be annoying to just be like, I just want to eat them. Uh, I was actually hoping to get another blessing so I could continue exploring. Oh well, shit happens. Yeah. I, I, I would, yeah. Wait, why didn't you I take like I... a city guard or something instead of this Aldrin Flox glove, motherfucker? Uh, because he can reduce damage, which it suits as a cleric, and it's also a succeed on four potential checks to acquire. Yeah, I'd rather be able to fucking explore, to be honest with you. I also have like six blessings. I have seven blessings, and I still would rather have a. Okay, yeah. I, I, I cycle through my blessings quick enough that it. it it's, so that's it, your it turn? Off. Just a heal? Um, I mean, you could attempt this barrier, I guess. No, because I used my free explore to heal, so. Okay. All right then. 
All right. Whoopi Goldberg continues her... Hmm. Examine the top card of location deck. If it's a boon, you may add to your hand. If undefeated, you may banish. Um, wisdom? Yeah. Um, six. Yeah. Whatever. A. I take two damage from that. So that'll be Warhammer and I guess the Elven Breastplate's better, right? No. Uh, Magic Halfplate? Magic Halfplate's the better one. Um. Oh no, actually the Elven Breastplate's better because it's revealed to reduce combat damage by two. The Halfplate is recharged to reduce by three. Right. How many times have I ran into one of those? Okay, cool. Perfect. Well, I need to blow this guy up. Divine six. All right. Let's do it. I want to fuck this guy up. Uh, wisdom seven check. Okay. Wisdom seven. Um, yep. Nope. Um, all right. So it goes by two. So 13. All right. So D10. Plus, uh, D8 plus D10. And a D6. Plus 6. Okay. Oh, you already had one. Sorry. Yeah. So that is dead. <laughs> cool. Um, now I will ch attempt to close this. Divine 6 check. Or banish a blessing. Divine 6. So D8 plus 2. Uh, plus six, so d8 plus three. Oh, yeah, good. It is closed. You may banish a blessing to draw a random blessing from the box. I don't have a blessing, so. I yeah. guess you can do, you could use that to try and cycle your blessings. Oh, or something. good. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'm glad I didn't have to get another two damage because that would have hurt a lot. All right. Cool. So we have two locations left. Uh, you're up, Malo. Malo. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to flip that. That's the one. Mm -hmm. Going to move to the city gates. Yeah. Uh, nothing happens. When Are I'm... you sure you don't want to try mine? Because I uh, have might actually be uh, an idea. Yeah. Why is that? Because actually, can... no, don't, because you'll have to refresh your hand That's not on bad. your next turn, which is annoying. Well, yeah. You want me to help you clear it? Um, I can probably do it on my next turn. If I, if I get a blessing, I'll be able to do it. That's it. I didn't have a blessing last time. That's the only reason I failed it. Okay. Right. So I'm just going to stay here. And... Mm -hmm. Look. Yay, that's Wisdom Survival, Charisma Diplomatic. Let me guess. The two worst. Wisdom D6, Charisma D6. Mm -hmm. You can't get it. Oh, you can go the can't Diplomacy. Charisma, so you can roll D6 and hope for a 6. Whee! Nope. Nope. Uh, don't really think I have anything else I can do. Nope. All right. Um, nope. You're up. Yo. Okay. I will. I'm getting through this pretty hand. quickly, I guess. There we go. All right. Uh, so I need to bust through this trapped passageway. Uh, uh, I will use a blessing. Get me another D12. You can do an aid as well. Uh, I mean, 2D12 is probably going to be enough to get it. Uh, can you copy that for me? Sure. Thank you. Should I use the aid, do you think? No. Nah. I don't think I, I need it. I mean, it's gonna refresh either way, so. Um, 
Yeah, but I might want it after this because I'm going to explore mm. with the other blessing. Sure. Let's let uh, let's roll the dice. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I got it. So okay. okay. So that was your uh, explore then, yeah? You explored. Now you have to explore. Yeah, that was my explore. Uh, I'm going to use my staff of minor healing. To heal yourself for one card. Yeah, I, I, I may as well. There's a good chance I'll get a blessing for it. Mm. And I'm not going to have it in my hand on the next turn, so holding it just because it's divine isn't worth it. Exactly. Uh, I will use my last blessing and explore. Mm. Zombie nest. Um... Gee, I really enjoy being here. Uh, each character at this location summons and encounters a zombie henchman. Should be the second one from the top, man. Uh, uh, no, those were skeleton henchmen. Oh, okay. Uh, zombie, is it zombie minion? Zombie minion, yeah. Yep. Uh, luckily, I have holy light, which I'm going to use. <laughs> Why not? Fuck it. Yeah. So I get a D12 and, and a D12. No, no, no. Two D12. It's under. Oh, 2d12. So I get 3d12. Mm -hmm. uh, can I get a third one? Thank you. Uh, so 3d12 plus 2. How do you say yeah, crushed into zombie? <laughs> uh, if any character is not defeated, uh, no, it's Sorry. defeated. Cool. Uh, uh -huh. uh, so all I have left is aid, but I can't use it for anything. So that ends my turn. Cool. Oh, I didn't, I didn't, uh, suit up. Oh, should I have one HP left? Hm. Fun. Um, I think I'm going to go to Doc. Actually, no, that's bad. It's, it recharges, not refresh. It, it, like, so you would still have the same amount of HP. It's just that you would cycle your cards. I know, I know. But then you're going to heal me, I hope. Can you leave? That, that is... I can leave it, yes. Right. Okay. Uh, oh, should I choose? Uh, strength melee. Okay, easy. Hey, this is a good way for you to get a bit of extra HP, right? Yeah. Yep. Nine. Plus five. <laughs> um, okay. One D four. Two. All right. So crowbar and braces of protection. Well, they get discarded anyway, but I can keep exploring. So I can explore twice essentially from this. Why are you discarding those now? I'm not. I'm oh, you weren't. Oh, sorry, I thought you were putting that up in your discard. No. No, no, hang on. Just hold on to those. They're free HP. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So. Cool. All right. All damage dealt to the siren is mental damage that cannot be reduced. Okay, great. If undefeated, examine top three. Okay, whatever. I can just slap and tickle this lady. Um... Do you want an aid? I mean, you might as well use it, right? Uh, yeah. This is... Oh, yeah. This is plus... Actually, no, I don't need it, because I got a plus six. Okay. And, uh... I got plus five, sorry. So... Two ones would mean the only the only way that I could lose that, so... Um... Are you sure about that? Now I will take the uh, aid. <laughs> Do you want it on the wisdom check or the combat check? Mm, combat. I don't care if I fail the wisdom. It's not a big deal. Um, Actually, technically, you can't even take damage from him. But you'll have to bury the top card of your deck, which will still leave you with 5 HP. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so what is it? A D7 on a wisdom check. 
it gets two more difficult. So he's 13. So I'll take your help. This is plus five. Uh, I have a 1d6, my good sir. Uh, Nine plus sure. five is more than 13. I do. Um, all right, so summon a bandit, uh, which I believe is a d8, if I remember correctly. <clears throat> Recharge a card of your choice from your hand. Hmm. I guess I'll recharge the crowbar. Why? It's so... Because the other one is damage reduction, so... Alright. Uh, maybe... Alright. Cool. Oh, that's good. I can just, I can just get d6s all the time now. <laughs> uh, so this is plus six. Yeah, dead. All right. It's closed. Uh, what happens when I close this place? Oh, no effects. What do we miss out on? Braces of protection. Flaming. Oh, oh. goodies for, my, for me. Oh. That's actually pretty good. I wish I'd had that. That would have been nice. Yeah. That's that's a cleric item, right? A flaming <laughs> mace. It's like, who does this belong to? What is it? A flaming mace. Cleric. Cleric. A whole bunch of goodies for me. Well, I mean, we get some good goodies at the end of this, so don't worry about it. Yay. Uh, so the only place left is the Shadow War Clark. Yep, which is where the lady is, so, as it turns out. So, yeah. yeah. What? Which means we're all going to be sitting on it. Yeah. Let's go with that one. Not me, though. Oh, look, uh, I, yeah, I think you should probably actually stay there, and I'll come over there to heal you. Yeah, I'm thinking that's what's going to happen. Flip. Uh, intellect, the king, wisdom, divine. So, when the best is wisdom. Yeah. Yeah, and the only one a one. It's it's a two to acquire, so it's like you can, as long as you have the ability to acquire it, you can. Well, I got her. All right, it. Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm gonna really do anything else. Use? Well, if you don't want it, I can use it. I mean, I don't use it. Zip, Zippy's the one that uses detect magic, and he's got plenty of them. He doesn't mm -hmm. fucking need any more. No. So you don't want it, Henley? No, I, I thought you not. No, then I'm going to use it. I'm finish it. So I can look at the top card. If it's a blessing or a magic card, I get to keep it. It is her. Good. Maybe I should come so, over. Good luck. Well, uh, now we know what's there. <laughs> So why don't you come over and heal me, and I'll go over and fuck her up. Yeah, uh, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. Uh, so well, we only have 19 turns to do it, so... Yeah, only 19 turns, and we're down to one stack. We've done fucking brilliantly. To be fair, we got a lot of henchmen up top, so... Yeah. All right, I uh, will... Give me blessing and a cure. That he needs I kind of like this. Like, recharging my hand at the start of every turn is actually nice. All right, so maybe use... Move, use Holy Light to cure me. I won't be able to move again. Probably. But that's okay, you still have a blessing. Um, you know what I think? I... Yeah. Uh, so I can move to you to cure you with Holy Light. Yeah, for a D4 plus 2. Okay. Why don't you have a uh, 4? Okay, that'll make it so that I can't die. So that's good. Yeah. Um, yeah, and then you can give me a blessing next turn. So. Uh, yeah? I have this guy too, if you want. Can you trade? Yeah, as long as you're in the same location, you can trade items. 
can trade stuff. Don't I have to discard down to five at the start of my turn? No, you have to discard down to five at the end of your turn. Okay. All right then. Uh, well, flip a thing. Go over. Explore. Oh, look who it is. So, check to defeat. Wisdom um, or two combats. I think I might do wisdom. Wisdom's not so bad for me. Um, Would you uh, like a blessing? Well, no. Hang on. I'm rolling 2d8 plus nothing if I do wisdom. But I only have to do one roll. Or I can do two combat checks and roll plus six. I think I'll do the two combat I mean, if you're doing combat checks, you're rolling... Yeah, plus a bazillion. 2d8 so. plus three, plus your horse chopper. No, 2d8 plus... plus four, plus five. Sorry, four, and then, plus five. And then one extra then from plus can... six from this. So, And then I get another yeah. six from the soldier and your blessing. So I think we'll do that. I think we'll do combat. So, um, okay. Uh, do you want the blessing on the second one? Yes, of course. Yeah. All right, so <clears throat> first time, cool. So I get a d6 plus one, so we're rolling 1d6, 1d8, and 1d10 plus six. For a total of 21 plus 20, plus, so 27. And the second one, I'll take your blessing. There you go. So that gives me d8, and uh, then I will, oh, look at that. What luck. May as well throw your soldier in there to add another D4. Is it D4? That's why, I get, that's why I gave you Elden so that you'd still have a dude to close with, but we don't need it. It's okay. I, I didn't even realize that. I was like, oh, if I give him this, he can use the soldier. 29. We're good. That's that's 35. <laughs> yep. She dead. I trust a little band of murderers is doing well, gathering greedy souls for, the, for our Lord's rise. Not really. Uh, we're just killing bitches. Um, so yeah, that's it. Game over, man. Game over. Uh, Game over, man. Game over. So, uh, loot. Impaler of Thorns, Medusa Mask. Okay, so these things. So we get Medusa's Mask. Alright, so we get to... Impaler of Thorns, Spear Melee. For your combat check, reveal this card to roll Strength Melee plus 1d8 plus 2. Oh, God. May additionally discard this card to also reduce the difficulty... To defeat the Bane by two until the end of the turn. To defeat the Bane. If you aren't proficient with weapons... Okay. Well, that sounds like it might be a me card. Uh, Realist card to add one to your dex check. That seems like a good card for our um, bouncy lady. Bouncy lady is that me? Sheridan, discard this card and reduce damage dealt to you by four. What's this one? Cat... Encounter a monster. You may display this card. Put the monster atop it. The monster is neither defeated or undefeated. At the end of your turn, put the monster on top of the original location deck and bury this card. Uh, well, I can't take an item anyway, so... I'll take it's a spear. loot. I'll take the spear. Oh, it's a loot? loot. Yeah. Oh, no, sorry, it is an item. I kind of think I, I, sh I, I want this, because quite often it'll come up where I won't be able to fight, but you two can. Mm-hmm. Like okay. Everyone else in the party is like, I can fight. It's cool. I could use this if that if the situation comes up where something is in Kansas. Like, so I'm what do we do it. with loot that we don't take? Uh, uh, are we supposed to only get three loot? No, you get four. Reward. Loot. All four. Um, I think we should try to take them. Yeah. Well, um, I don't... I can take both. You can take oh, both? The last turn. The snake skin uh, tunic and the medallion. Okay, yeah, if you can take both, then take both. Absolutely. Keep in mind, you have to keep to your skill, your your hand size or whatever the fuck that is, so... Mm -hmm. Alright, so that's all of Act 2 done. All of Act 2. Uh, okay, so I don't need... Aldrin, um, I don't need the crowbar, I don't need the braces of protection. You f feel free to take any of these that, that you want, Malo. Um, um, one, two, three. Okay, we're free. Uh, 
Um, okay, so I don't know what weapon I want to throw away because I only get three. So, <laughs> Doc, my choices are Horse Chopper, Warhammer, Icy Long Spear, and Impaler of Thorns. <laughs> uh, do any of you want guidance? No. Do any of you want guidance? Nope. Trust me, no one wants guidance. <laughs> Nobody wants the guidance. I think I'm missing a spell. Yeah, I'm missing a spell from somewhere. I don't know where it is gone. Alright, I don't need these two. Do you remember what the spell I had was? Oh, that's right. It was, um... Uh... I put it around his No, no, no. I put it around his somewhere. I don't know where it's gone, though. It was in my discard file. Oh, here it is. Right. Sorry, there's more. Here it is. I found it. It's in flicked. Yep. I still got it. All right. Uh, okay. I don't need all these blessings. So, um, is there anything of these weapons that mm -hmm. suit you, Doc? The Warhammer? Uh, so, I have... Short sword plus one in the glaive. Um, maybe, maybe take the warhammer. What's that? One d eight plus one. This is one d six. But it's also plus bludgeoning. One. Yeah, it's also bludgeoning. Yeah, so. warhammer is probably better than the short sword plus one. Yeah, I'll I'll swap for that. Sure. Um, what can you use weapon wise over here? You can't. You can't use weapons. Okay. Yeah. I can't use weapons. So the dagger and the and the dart. Right now is the best for me. Okay. All right. I have a crowbar and a blessing of the gods if you want it. Nope. I don't want them. Um, I gave up crowbar. Hey, did you take the, the plates? Or whatever it was? The uh... Uh, I took the plates, yeah. Okay. The braces of One protection. Second. Braces, yeah. Um, I have to leave. Uh, we have to eat now. Okay. No worries. Well, thanks uh, for playing. Thank I you guess. for letting me join this one, and maybe I'll be able to join another time. Sounds good. All right. Let's Let me just group all of this up. No, 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 no. You put the lady in there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Crazy person. Touch not. Uh, thank you guys, and I'll see you all. Well, tomorrow it is. Yeah, tomorrow. Yep. Okay. Later. See ya. All right, so then there was two. So, Doc, how's it going? He's probably not here anymore. <laughs> oh, I'll clean this up. And so what did we miss? Uh, these tools. Uh, that's an item, not armor. Okay, that's better. And... Okay. Alrighty, um, how many cards should he have? Sorry, I'm back. No worries. Uh, 16. 16? Alright, so that leather armor should be in the stack then. Don't think he was supposed to have armor anyway. Uh, okay, so that's pretty much it. That's a wrap, I think. Um, so let me just finish cleaning this up. All right, so you want to take off those last two points for me? Yep. All 
All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think that pretty much sums up uh, Pathfinder game thus far. We're getting through it. We've got... Uh, well, for some reason, that's missing four and five in there. But, uh, yeah, we are on three of six. So we're almost halfway done with this whole thing. Um... Doc, what do you think of the game so far? You still still keen on it? Um, I I don't want to uh, jinx myself, but it's getting a bit easier out here. Just saying. That's kind of the problem that a lot of people said was with this game that it it does eventually get to the point where you're creaming literally everything because, like I said, like the, like the paladin for example, just being like boom, 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 you know. Adding. Yeah, that was the that was the main complaint I saw was that after a point you were just flipping cards and rolling dice and you were just going through the motions it wasn't as strategic as it used to be mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah and i i was like assuming that would have happened like sometime in the middle of the first or second adventure but it, it it's come on really quick yeah yeah so you know it um i mean we're in the middle kind of now we're, we're just about to hit the middle the start of the middle at least anyway um but you know this is what this game is and um like you can see why they slowly dole out like the skills and the card upgrades and all that shit um because you know it's pretty much the same and same um so maybe next week we, you want to try a gloomhaven or something like that i don't know might be a cool one uh yeah i'll have to have a look at it and see how it actually plays but yeah, i yeah. am definitely excited to try it yeah i heard it's like uh D, &D without a d and without a gm so we'll see how yeah. we go with that Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed tonight's session. Um, I don't know what my status will be tomorrow for a daily stream because, as I said, we're going to go look at a car um, during the day. Um, but, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, tomorrow is going to be the first episode of Die Party Noose, which is a um, Deadlands Reloaded role-playing adventure. Uh, we have four players for that now, so that'll be fun. Um uh and yeah that's that's tomorrow for character creation uh but yeah until then guys have a good one we outie bye bye